Hello. How's it going? Big slurp. <laughs> no, it is not co op last time I checked. <laughs> uh, Kim has back. now activated texting and driving. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> what? Thank you for Wait. the resubscription, but what? <laughs> <laughs> I beg your fucking pardon. <laughs> Surely you're not the one driving. The, the ultimate multitasker, uh, the multitasker goal. <laughs> no, it is not co-op. No, it does not have loot boxes. Also, that is loud on my end, so I can only imagine it's quite loud on yours. But if somebody could check that for me, that'd be great. Audio, check audio. Yay, check audio. <laughs> <laughs> I know my mic is usually fine. I still have to, like, play around with Discord audio levels because I spend a lot of time solo. <laughs> Can we tell what we're doing? <laughs> yeah. Who is my co-host? That is a me. good question. <laughs> me. <laughs> Her name is me. <laughs> 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 I mean, you've been on the channel before, but go ahead and introduce yourself for the new folks. Uh, Madame Spectrum. You may know me as this gentleman here's a uh, lovely girlfriend, and I am here because I'm very passionate about Paper Mario, way more than I probably should in my life. And I may or may not have been blasting through this game this past week, so I can help him out! <laughs> <laughs> as you know, I am bad at games. I could use all the help I can get. <laughs> listen, listen, it's doable, okay? I'm not perfect. <laughs> But it is absolutely doable. You could have been actually texting a drip. Kim, oh I have God. my doubts. <laughs> you didn't want to pay for gas. Oh dear. Don't text and drive. Please Why? do not text and drive. Let's get started. Oh hey, it's the trailer. <laughs> Today. I'm going to tell you the story of the Thousand Year Door. There are parts for this text box goes fast. An so awfully we... long time ago, in a strange and far off land, a big bustling town thrived. It was a town where all people lived very happy lives. And it was said that the town was very prosperous. That's a big cheap cheap. But one day, tragedy befell this blessed place. A great cataclysm struck the town and its people. Darkness filled the skies, and the earth roared and shook. It was as if the very world had come to a violent end. Hurricane Katrina? <laughs> and in but a single night, the town sank into the depths of the earth. Many moons rose and set. Stories of the town passed into the pages of fairy tales. And when the town's sight no longer held relics of its past, People gathered at that spot and built a new town. 
but word soon spread among the people who moved in that an ancient city lay deep underground, and that magnificent treasure rested there. Indeed, this is the tale of the fabled treasure of Rogue Ports. Yes, this is where it begins, in the sea town Rogueport. The tale of the quest for the legendary treasure, and the thousand year door starts here. So we're pulling a Kingdom Hearts where it takes us way too long to open one door. You will open the door. <laughs> I have a minute without Toadsworth watching over me. He's so paranoid. I come all the way here on holiday, only to be stuck with Toadsworth. <laughs> it's so stifling. <laughs> God damn it, Cloud. <laughs> damn. <laughs> uh, but that one door is worth a thousand, and you don't even have to fight Disney to do it. Fair. Once in a while, I'd like the chance to look around on my own, and see what I want. Doing it only sees that this town has a very, um, distinct flavor. Ow! Oh, miss? <laughs> Missy! Missy! Won't you buy something? I have a wide assortment of knickknacks and doodads, but this is a special favorite. Well, that's a pretty box. What's inside it? This box holds a map that shows where to find treasure. The box has a magic lock on it, and it will only open for a pure and noble heart. Oh, so this is Kingdom Hearts. Goody. <laughs> as you can see, it won't so much as budge if one such as me Every collab it. with him is Kingdom Hearts. Oh. Oh. I mean, did you watch Metroid Prime 2? <laughs> If the box will open for you, Missy, then you may have whatever is inside. <laughs> Go on, hold it. Suppose I could try opening it. <laughs> God damn it, Kim. You know I'm not good at voice acting. Do not notice. Kim, what? <laughs> Kim, what? <laughs> she, she forgot I'm a. She forgot I am female. <laughs> male call. Here's the mail. It never fails. It makes me wanna <laughs> wag my tail. When it comes, I wanna wail. Mail. You look so proud of yourself. <laughs> hey, bro, check it out. A letter from Princess Peach arrived for you. Easter egg in the background, you can see the partners from 64. Nice. It's so cute. I'll just read it to you. How's that sound? I want to uh, um. 1080p of that image, please and thank you. <laughs> now, let's see here. Not well, Cloud. Hello there, Mario. I'm now on holiday. Traveling in the Mushroom Kingdom. In my travels, I came into possession of a mystical map. Treasure map, actually. Ins it was inside a box I caught from an old merchant in a town called Rogueport. Don't mind the name, it's actually very peaceful. But since it would be too difficult for me to try and go find the treasure all by myself... I thought you could help me hunt for it. You will, of course, won't you? <laughs> You're doing it. <laughs> I've included the map with this letter, so please bring it with you when you come. I'll meet you at Rogueport. That means you must come. Peach. <laughs> what do you know? You're it's coming. True. There is no choice. <laughs> Honestly, there's a wizard old map in here with the letter. Check it out. Okay, but why don't we bring Luigi with us? <laughs> I don't wanna. <laughs> now we're on a boat! I mean, like... 
paper mache aesthetics aside, that water is pretty nice looking. I'm excited. I'm excited. I love this series. I'm excited. Prologue! A rogue's welcome. A mystical coin that changes faces. <laughs> Rob, that's probably what he's doing. He got a tennis match going on. He don't feel like coming. Uh, excuse me, sir. S tier voice. <laughs> uh, please wake up, sir. Uh, the town you've been speaking of has come into view. Look, that's Rogueport. Heads are to. Well, actually, it's Mario or Peach or Bowser or. Uh. You see, we'll Corrupt arrive organization shortly. Signal. So, uh, Please I mean, you prepare know to disembark. It's actually one in four, uh, like, like a 25% chance instead of 50-50, you know? There's higher stakes. <laughs> I must apologize, sir. I'm a chuckster. Our arrival was delayed just by a bit of rough weather. Are you quite sure you want to disembark here? I... I did tell you all the sordid tales about Rogueport on our way here, did I not? Suit yourself. What's that? I'm sorry? You say there's a princess waiting here for you? That's so. Er, of course, sir. Well, if that's what you think, I won't stop you. But, uh, you be careful, sir. Don't say I didn't warn you. I love that it just flips. It doesn't turn around, it just yeah, flips. Yeah, no, listen. This is cuter. We're in Rogueport! It's just like downtown Harlem. <laughs> that is like not that. an exaggeration either. Shit. Oh, well, you know what I gotta do. Yes, I know what a save block is, game. Oh, yeah, and it automatically saves as soon as you hit it. There's no... Would you like to save? Are you having fun? So this is Rogueport. Here are all the lovely people that absolutely look incredibly approachable and definitely... <laughs> well, we have a couple of Sailor Bob-Bombs, which up. is a terrifying thought, because <laughs> one explosion Fire in... Fire in the hole! Hey, what do you want? Get away from me, freak! Uh, come off it! I know you're a nosy book nerd, so don't play dumb with me! I've seen you walking around town asking for information about them crystal dear 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 crystal stirs. <laughs> well, I'm now I'm done asking, so be a good little student and tell us what you know right now. You southern crazy. <laughs> Never! I don't have anything to say to you creeps. Ew! Damn. Well, that dear dear I suppose is a damn shame. Sassy little ass like you met with an untimely demise. <laughs> Boys, we're taking this firebrand to our fortress. Don't tell me that. As you, alert, as you command, Lord Crump, we're on it. No! Stop right there, you weirdos! I'll scream! Really! As if that's not what you've been doing already. <laughs> Listen. Listen. I want nothing works. to do with that. I'm gonna go hide in a corner. <laughs> Just hide it in a corner. It feels like the perfect spot to hide a secret, but there is no secret. <laughs> yeah, no, there isn't anything there. I guess I'll go help the girl. Like, I'd go anywhere with you smelly losers. Hmm, not likely. What, huh? What do you think you're doing, chump? You think you screw up my damn dare dare blur dare dare plans? <laughs> Just passing by. Ugh, it's always something. Looks like I'm gonna have to give you a little taste of the old crumple bomb. Something tells me I wouldn't want that. Oh. I don't think anybody would. First fight, first fight, first fight. Can't flee this fight. Rest in peace. <laughs> Battle time, Mr. Man. Just find a way to beat this Freak of the Week, okay? Freak of the Week is wild. Don't sweat the details. Just jump on him and hit him with your hammer. Yeah, we could do that, or... <laughs> Sweet! You know that hurt. Wow, I gotta say, you're tougher than you look. 
Keep it up and you'll beat him in no time. And yes, you can also guard as well. And you also get action action commands right off the bat, which is... I gotta admit, so much better than the first game. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that is one like downside about the, the original game is that it takes you a while to get action commands. It takes you... the entire prologue and then like you get it right at the start of chapter one, I think. Yeah, like right before chapter one. You've got him on the ropes. Come on. Keep wailing on him. Although this does head canon that Mario's just kept like the star pendant from the first game like this whole time. I can I believe like it. That head give him a good stompage. Didn't even give me 10. How lame. Yeah, one short. Bro was a schmuck. Couldn't even give 10 star points. You did it. You did it. Yes. And you got star points. That's what these little things are. Star points. Can I just point out? Mario's head is tilted towards the camera, which means <laughs> he tilted his head in confusion. As if he had never seen star points before. Yeah. Yeah, no, for nothing. Mario, you can do action commands. You have the battle pendant. You know what those are. He just forgot. I guess. <laughs> the star points will you get will show you up there. When you get 100 points, you'll go up a level. Don't forget that, okay? Oh, yeah. You won't forget that. <laughs> okay, you got a couple decent shots in. I'll give you that. But unfortunately for you, that means... It's go time! Go time. Oh! Um, oh, actually, oh um, actually, um, actually, um, actually, no, um, actually, um, actually, um, actually, um, actually, um, actually, punish him! Tell me they dodged him! Um, actually, ah. um, actually, it's Twitter. It's just Twitter. <laughs> it's just Twitter! <laughs> oh my god! They're called x knots Bunch of bozos. Let's just get out of here. What do you say? <laughs> They're ex knots. Thank you. Uh, God damn it. <laughs> I, I already missed it. the spin from the first game. I can't wait to fight you on Musk. <laughs> Stop eating me in it. Where'd they go? Huh, you, you uh, uh, Johnson, did you see them? Did anyone? Um, actually, no. No one saw them. Ugh, oh, crud, they bolted. How did no one see that? I'll never know. Well, from the look of it, they're idiots, so... <laughs> wow, mister, you totally saved me. Thanks! I just got to give you a little reward. And that is, oh. Just the overalls. My name's Goombella. I'm a junior at the University of Goo. <laughs> yeah, I didn't want to say anything, but I was like, there are several points you can use that voice. So, uh, who are you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> are you? You mean, like, that famous guy? Wow, I can't believe I met you here! Well, wait, no offense, but... It looks like you just rolled into town yourself, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they turned and looked at it, too. Stay down, bro. The boss sends his greetings. Oh, that been rude for... Oh, I didn't even get to read what he said. <laughs> you okay? That hurt. Those jerks. Hey, I already <laughs> hate it here. There are freaks and weirdos everywhere. It's nasty. Did... Listen, listen. Mind your business and you live longer, okay? <laughs> I grew up in New York. I know this. So did I. <laughs> I mean, I know the place is called Rogueport, so I should have expected it, but sheesh. I never come to a place like this if there wasn't some legendary treasure here. Oh. What? You're looking for the legendary treasure too? Seriously? 
Whoa, 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 bucko, what do you got there? Map! It's map time, map time, map time, map time. Oh my gosh, is, is that a map? You have to tell me where you got that. Peach? What? Alright, give me your best old man voice. Let's go. <laughs> Great hoogly boogly if it isn't Master Mario. S tier. Bit of a coincidence bumping into another one another in this sort of place. Mm. Ho ho! So tell me, Master Mario, what in the world brings you to this wretched little berg? I hate it here so much. I don't know why the princess decided to stop here of all places. Hmm, ah, uh, indeed. Princess Peach sent you a letter and a treasure map. And she told you she'd meet you here in Rogueport. Intriguing. She got bored. <laughs> You're asking me where the princess is. Hmm, I was about to ask you that. Well, we stopped in this town to acquire a spot of fuel for our ship. Don't you know? Yeah, y'all lost track of her. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. I only took my eye off her for a moment, but as soon as I did, she vanished. She's like a toddler. <laughs> you know how strong she is, Mario. Off. I just assumed she'd be back momentarily. But, uh, it's been like a week. <laughs> Honestly, kind of scared for her safety. <laughs> Tosaver just said nothing this whole time. <laughs> no letter. No, like, hey, uh, I think something might be wrong. Just fucking just chilled for a week. But, uh, at this point, I fear we must embrace the possibility that she may never return. But I'm feeling better with you here, Master Mario. Surely we'll find her, surely! But I know my place, Master Mario, and this is not it. I leave this test to you. I'm gonna go fuck off back to the castle, because I hate it here. <laughs> <coughs> I'm gonna stay at the inn for a little bit. Maybe I'll have some tea. In fact, I highly recommend it, particularly if your HP are running low. Just drop on in! <laughs> Uh, I guess anyway, oh. a little rest there will fill all your HP. I will say though, the rest bro. of this stone is a bit rough. Yes, rough indeed. No shit, it looks like oh, downtown Harlem. <laughs> um, princess Peach? Did he mean like Peach the Mushroom Kingdom princess? Why do you think I'm here? The princess who always gets nabbed by Bowser the Koopa King? The one you rescue? Why do you think he's here? Correct. <laughs> Wait a sec, this is wild. Princess Peach sent you that treasure map? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Perfect. Whoa, this is really intense. Well, where could she have gone then? Do you think? Do you think maybe she got sick of waiting and then went to find the treasure on her own? I could see it. Hmm. I actually can see it. <laughs> oh, oh, I know Mario, come with me. One of my professors is here researching that treasure. We'll show him your map. If we start looking for the treasure, then maybe we'll find some clues about Princess Peach. Great, we're all good then. Let's go, Mario. Is there a way to scroll back text in this game? No, I have been trying to find that. I, I have not found it. All right, Goombella's ability is a primer. I'm assuming when you approach people or objects, you may see an icon appear over Goombella's head. If that happens, you can press X to learn more about that person or object. So it's basically, um, Goombario. Yeah. That's Goomther, the Goomba. He's always complaining about being swindled or mugged. Maybe he's just gullible. <laughs> just saying. Possibly. To Rogueport Square! It's the center of town and the main business district. It's a crossroads where many people meet, including more than a few shady characters. Sometimes you'll learn interesting tidbits. Try using her ability whenever you can. This concludes... I, I think I'm good. <laughs> yeah. We'll get there. <laughs> First off, we gotta go find my professor. Thing is, since I just got to town myself, I um, don't actually know where he lives. <laughs> His name is Professor Frankly, and this is what he looks like. And we'll find him. I telepathically sent you that image. Oh, and before I forget to mention it, from here on, if you ever feel lost or confused, try pressing this. 
That'll be my cue to share any info I know, which might help us figure out what to do next. Studying pays off. And what he means by what he, she means by that is you press it in case you forget what you're supposed to do for the main campaign and let you know what we were doing, what we're supposed to be doing next. Gotcha. Very useful. How do I get? You're not getting that now. I haven't gotten it yet. Oh. Okay. All right, so let's start on this side of town and work our way across and see what we can find. My money! <laughs> hey, what's your beef, pal? Yeah, I'm talking to you! That guy just bumps into you and just runs off like that? Unbelievable. Some people here are so rude. I want my money back. Fuck you. Sorry, <laughs> Professor. You gotta wait. I <laughs> know, it's okay. You know, bro made off with half your loot. Yeah, it's fucking crazy. I bet you he's crazy. back here somewhere in the fucking alleyways. There's another Goomba here. Hi. Of course you are. I was a thief in another town until up about three good for months you. ago. Yeah, a good one. But then the heat came down and I needed to come to rope for it. So now I'm just lying low in this thief's den. Gotta keep it a secret. <laughs> I'm so sly. I'm so sly. I'm only gonna tell some random person my criminal history. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Door. You bitch! Give me my money back! Oops! Uh, fancy meeting you here. You're pretty dang persistent, buddy. What a pain! Fine, fine. You got me. I'll give you your coins back. Here. <laughs> Bro Thank knew you. he was about to get smoked. <laughs> That's all I wanted. <laughs> Somehow I knew he would be in those back alleys. <laughs> it was a good guess. I mean, he's a thief, so like... It only makes sense. Alright. Well, ain't that obvious. <laughs> yeah. Hey, there you are, Professor Frankly. What's that? Who's there? Who wants me? <laughs> uh, yes, you. Now you. Uh... I'm glad we've made the decision. For Wait what for it. To... Just a moment. Don't tell me now. Silence. Don't get it right. Um, it's not Gumbriel. It's not Eliza Goom. Mm. What a wonderful mm. world! Ah, I've got it! You're Goombella, aren't you? You were in my archaeology class last year, am I right? Wow, yes, that's me! I'm Goombella, at a junior at Yuku. Go Goombas! Of course I remember you, not to toot my horn, but I'm pretty good at remembering. You, uh, you stick out of my mind because you were such an exceptional student. And that guy behind you is... Who? <gasps> Mario! Professor, he's Mario! You know, the famous one? Oh, my apologies, I'm such a big worm. I haven't a clue what's hip right now. I'm also a time traveler, didn't you know? In any case, what sort of errand brings you two all the way to a place like this? We were hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure said to be below Roadport. I thought that if anyone knew of anything about it, it would be you, Professor Frankly. Of course I know about it. The reason I came here was to study that very subject. But why do you techs want to learn about the legendary treasure? You know, let most say it's little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have been have to search for the truth in those fairy tales, though. Me? I believe the legendary treasure truly does exist, and I really want to find it! Good point, and well made. In that case, I'll cooperate with you however I can. First of all, we should start by addressing just what the legendary treasure is. Some say it's an infinitely vast treasure hoard, while others say it's a magical item. Some books say it's actually a monster, while still others claim it's an empty chest. The clouds of white. <laughs> <laughs> A whole horizon of white. So many different theories. Obviously, it's impossible to divine the truth among them. But I'll agree on one point. To 
find the treasure. One must have the crystal stars. Well, there's our what MacGuffin. A wonderful world. <laughs> the crystal stars? To find the treasure of yore, take the seven crystal stars to the thousand year door. That's how the old saying goes. And with a rhyme that's all, it must be true. We'll Therefore, if you want to find the legendary treasure, you must collect the seven crystal stars. Oh, hey, I researched some of the written lore behind the treasure, and it kind of matches that old saying. Hold the magical map aloft before the entrance to the thousand year door. Then the stars will light the way that that leads to the stones of yesterday. The stones of yesterday. Is that referring to the same crystal stars you mentioned? Probably. And good <laughs> luck! The thousand year door is located somewhere beneath this town. Oh, shit. The critical piece of the puzzle, the magical lab, is lost. If only we had that map. But we do have it, Professor. Or, well, not we, exactly. Mario has the magical map. Say what? Hummada, 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 Okay, I'm sorry. Hummada, 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 hippity, hoobida, hummala, huffala, hoofala. Really? Bibbidi, bobbidi, boo. You actually have it? Could I just take a quick look at it, if you don't mind? It is map. Astounding! This is it! The real thing! The one and only magical map! <laughs> you, son, are my hero! You're great! Fantastic! Wonderful, even! With this map, we can locate the crystal stars just by holding it up in front of the thousand-year door! Right <sighs> on, Professor! Good golly, what are we doing just sitting here, then? Kumbella, Mario! Let's take the magical map to the thousand year door! All three must go this instant! I'll lead the way to the sewers underneath the town! Oh, this was a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I heard your struggles, don't worry. I just don't know how to. Hey, but you didn't know this rotten old thing came off, did you? <laughs> Peel it off! We can use this pipe to get down under the city streets. Come on, both of you, let's get moving! Oh wait, hang on a second. Mario, something just occurred to me. Really certain there are quite a few hoodlums below, so uh, keep your guard up. No, I'm good. I'm good. Please, leave me be. I don't want to do your voice anymore. <laughs> yes, yes, I know how to guard. It tells us, tells us anyway. Yes, yeah, so you press A to enter through pipes this time. Probably for the best. Probably. Rogue port, sub level one. Below Rogue port. Hey, hey man, what's up? You think it's cool to just waltz your way into our underground? Typically, your surface level snobs are so stuck up. Ooh, I gotta see the sun. I like to breathe clean air. Ooh. Yeah, <laughs> come on over here, Scrappy Mustache Man. We're gonna teach you some proper manners. Leave him alone. Can't two academics and a world famous hero wander the sewers in a, of a port town in peace? Apparently not. If this is your usual greeting to visitors, then you must have learned it down here because it stinks. Ouch! That was cold. Well, you <laughs> too good for a fight. If you ain't looking to tussle, then stay out of the sewer. Nobody's done to start a fight with us. Nobody. Let's get him. This dialogue was changed from the original one, and in the original one, they tried hitting on Gubella, and she shut them down. <laughs> Can't flee this fight. Oh, no. Whatever will I do? Fuck off, Professor. A Goomba, a spiky Goomba, and a parrot Goomba. My, oh, my. The whole Goomba family tree. The only one I should worry you about is the spiky yeah, Goomba. Goomba. Yeah, the spikes, well, that's gonna hurt. Blinds. Yeah, I get Blind it. Strategy! Yes, I know how action commands work, Professor. I already declined your fucking tutorial. Oh, for fuck's sake. 
Forgot to tell you something vital. Fist wide, it changes the order you two attacking. You could attack first if you feel like it, Kumbella. Don't forget that. I'll be, uh, watching from a safe distance. Good luck. You fucking coward. It also, was... yeah, uh, be careful because if you put Kumbella out in the front, she will be taking the brunt of the attacks. Whoever's out in front is going to be taking the brunt of the attacks. I learned that the hard way. Okay. I'm going to intentionally fail that so he survives. Perfect. It's a Goomba. Yeah, I'm one of those in case you haven't noticed. Um, it says here Goombas are underlings of other underlings. No standout features to know. That's totally rude. Maximum HP is 2, attack power is 1, and their defense is 0. Oh, I kind of get the underling thing now. <laughs> Damn. Perfect. 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 Although, I should tell you one thing about guarding. Um, so there are regular guards, which you have been doing this whole time, but there are also super guards. You guard with B, and the timing window for when you guard is a lot smaller compared to regular guards, so... If you make successfully do it, you could do kind of sort of a counterattack thing. Perfect. That's a spiky Goomba. A spiky headed Goomba. What a creative name. Max HP is two, attack two, and defense is zero. Guess that spike helps boost his attack compared to the average Goomba. As it should, it's a fucking spike. The addition of the spikes means you'll hurt your feet if you jump on it, though. There you go, yeah. Uh, so yeah, super guards, um, they're really cool if you could manage the timing of them, but they're a lot harder to do. Mm -hmm. And I would not recommend it on certain times in the game, <laughs> if I'm being honest. Hmm. Pair Goomba, basically a Goomba with wings. I'm jealous! Max HP two, attack one, defense zero. Can't hammer it while it's flying, but rough it up with a jump and it'll totally plummet. If it loses its wings, does it become a regular Goomba for the rest of its life? No one ever talks about this! I mean, also... It's just dead. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, supercars could be very useful if you're like... How did these dumb mooks fight? give me 10 points and the fucking <laughs> mini-boss didn't? And they gave me extra coins after the battle, too. Later on, losers. That felt awesome. Are you ready, Mario? There are plenty more where they can run, and they'll all have it in for us. When they attack, try to hammer them or jump on them while in the field. Attack successfully, and you can perform a first strike. First strikes there, here in this game. <sighs> okay. Well, it looks like there's nothing over way. here. But you can maneuver over that way. Sub level two. Did the first game have action commands on the, uh, on the first strikes? Uh, I don't think it did. I think this is a new one in this game as well. Okay. Also, if you want, I could educate you on stylish moves. Say what now? Yeah, you don't remember those? So, um, in, uh, you do, like, sort of bonus, um, action, action commands that you can do. It helps you make, like... It helps you do like little flares for, you know, an audience that we should help cultivate eventually. And it's very useful for something that we're going to get a in a little bit. Uh -huh. So you're going to do your hammer attack. So hammer it. And I want you to press A immediate. Try to press A immediately after, you know, the after you hit the enemy. Hellish. Okay. Yes, and every single attack that you could distribute 
almost every single attack has this option. For is it always do. pressing A? Yes, it's it is always A. It's no it's no other uh button. And I don't oh. Yeah, don't do that. If if Mario's like looking like he's like, oh I don't wanna fall on that, uh trust him. <laughs> gotcha. You got an item. So, yeah, and there is a very easy way to learn these. Um we haven't, you know, seen that yet, but trust me, there is an easy way to learn these uh, stylish moves. Depth perception, why? How could you fail me? <laughs> oh. Now, does she get it too, or just Mario? Yes, she does. Um, I don't remember exactly. I think it's after the attack. Hmm. Or, no, I think it's right before it. It's right before she starts, like, the first jump on her, on her, uh, action Okay. Command. Yeah, hers is a little weird. I'm, I'm not good at the, that timing on that one. Fireflower! Useful. Hammer. Hammer. You can't mess with that. <laughs> mm. I know, it looks so tempting. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Thank you. Monkey Jumbo 48. Thank you. Oh. What are you? I don't know. Oh. Doesn't matter, you notice me anyway. Okay, goodbye. Hello, Springman. Springman. You guys have a better look in Super Paper Mario, anyways. Uh, I guess I can beat the first one and then tattle the second. That's a Spinia! A totally weird creature made of thin, papery boards. It certainly looks unique. Nobody knows much about these creatures, actually. Max HP 3, attack is 1, and defense is 0. Its attacks are super swift, but it should be pretty easy. Just give it a hee Or, yeah, that's actually a pretty good hee Also, for a jump, you could press A at the height of the first jump you make. So, like, when you're at the very top, top after the first jump, you could press A. And, and that's the, the very stylish? Height of this... Yep, and there's another one, too, at the very t height of the second jump, too. When you jump, okay. when you're even higher. So it's sort of like, if you think about it rhythmically, it's like one and two and three. Yeah, no, you're getting it. Okay. Yeah, it's hard to kind of... You bitch! Focus oh, oh no! You motherfucker! Yeah, please use items in this game! Oh my god! I haven't seen them use those! Oh dear. You know what? If it's any consolation, there are way worse places for this to have happened, so... Wake up! It would be overkill. Yeah, it would be overkill. <sighs> Just hit it with the jump. You need to practice your stylish moves anyway. <laughs> he deserves to burn for his sins. <laughs> he wanted to burn the papery boards of his flesh. Although that is a good lesson learned, you cannot do anything with that. Um, good lesson learned for us to go Key. over. Uh, if an enemy has an item, it is very good to it is good practice to kill that enemy first. Mm. Yes, that is a key. Depth perception, please. You peeled it back. It is a box. That is a trap. <laughs> so distrusting. <laughs> Listen, humor me, okay? You hit Gumbella for her. <laughs> what did she ever do to you? Hey, you! Can you hear me? 
Exactly confident that we could trust this chest. Me neither, Professor. Me neither. I think it may be best not to mention that we're looking for the crystal stars. Oh shit. I just said it out loud, what's wrong with me? You're fucking oh, yeah? idiot! Searching for the crystal stars are you now? So you really are a hero. God damn it, Professor! <laughs> you're fucking idiot! <laughs> well you're definitely gonna need my help if you hope to get those bad boys. So first you should look for it, the key to the chest, and use it to let me out. Definitely. Definitely. Not and Jack sure. the Ripper came out of the horse. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking clown! <laughs> Not sure how this chest guy would know anything about crystal stars. What do you think we ought to do? Hmm. Well, I know Michael gets to go find the key and search around here somewhere. This is what the key looks like, but I just saw that. Come on, dude, stuck in a box is no picnic. I'm counting on you, old great legendary hero. No, oh, it's right there. We can't do anything with that unless there was a Aha. giant pool of water below us. Then it would be a springboard. Or a diving board is the right is the right term, I think. Hey chess guy, I found your uh, key. Hey, Palu, how you doing? You've got the key! Yes, man, I owe you big time! Yes! Your back is messed up! Thank nothing. <laughs> Fools. Oh, dear. Oh, it's a purple background! You look like Count Black! <laughs> Working. <laughs> Oh yeah, I guess it is about work time for you. It's just Stan from Okage. <laughs> oh shit. Oh boy, did you fall for it? I burned you, what? You think I was gonna help you? Instead, I'm gonna spread a little of the suffering I've endured in that stupid box. Yeah, You're sorry. Back. But those are the breaks. I'm gonna cast an evil, terrible curse upon you. Boogly woogly woo, you're cursed. Oh, you shot, shot us with <coughs> lightning, sir. <laughs> Enjoy that curse, sucker. You got what you deserved. You want to hear all about the sweet curse that I just dropped? The then listen well. From now on, if you press Y in certain areas, you'll turn into a paper airplane. Is that really a curse? <laughs> Trembling yet? Suffer the rest of your days under my terrible curse. <laughs> Oh, I can't help but chortle. You are doomed. The curse is pretty rough, I guess. So I, po I suppose I owe it to you to explain it. Ready? If you stand on an airplane panel like this one, the floor will Such start to kind, glow. Such a kind, malicious spirit taking the time to explain the curse that we got. Honestly. Okay, you're on the panel. Press Y. And boom, you're a paper airplane. You'll control it by pressing the you're, left stick you're... forward and back. Yeah, so it's like actual plane control, so you'll pull back and you'll go up. Oh, okay, I get it now. <laughs> gotcha. Yeah, okay. Don't, yeah. Actual plane controls. Suffer the total aerodynamic humiliation! <laughs> S tier dialogue. Okay, I think I got it now. <laughs> when you've had enough airplane shame, press B to deplane and get back to normal. Okay, that seems neat. So to be honest, you feel it? Yeah, I get it. Yes. Farewell, you foolish fool. <laughs> we are indeed foolish fools. So, uh, wow? Just wow? What was that guy's beef? 
Don't worry about it. <laughs> Good question. Also, I guess I did get cursed. So... That was a fucking lame-ass curse if that's the case. <laughs> so we're gonna fly... All the way home. Outstanding. So what's over here? Could it be? Oh, Out it's the title drop. Door, 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 door. <laughs> oh, Mario Goombella, look at that! <laughs> Is that the thousand year door? I can't believe it's real! So, the legends are all true! Come, let's move closer! Might this as well. motherfucker. This is the site of the famed Thousand Year Door. The air ripples with power. I read that this is where the ancient palace at the center of the ancient town was. Fun fact there. Interesting. I also didn't mean to press X. I wanted to press A. <laughs> well, you know what? You learned a bit of tiny lore, so... Yeah, I guess. Can never hurt. Runes! Ancient runes in a Mario game. I love this series. Professor, what's going on? We have the power! Interesting. He just turns into He-Man. By the power of Grayskull! <laughs> <laughs> the map! Oh, hey! Color! Yeah, color! I didn't know we were playing Color, color Splash! splash. <laughs> <laughs> my, re my reaction was so fast! <laughs> yeah. Disappointment was immeasurable. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's modern paper, Mario. <laughs> the location of the crystal star has been recorded on your magical map. And Mario has learned a special move. You can now use Sweet Treat. Say what? <laughs> I'm good at making those. <laughs> <laughs> Professor, the map! And what was with all those strange lights? Hmm, this looks like information related to the location of a crystal star. In that shining light, it looked as if a mysterious power was given to Mario. Well, one way or another, we should return to my place and study the map closely. Oh, yeah. Alright, Louis Armstrong, let's go. <laughs> Louis Armstrong. Hmm, aha, I see! You understand it, Professor? Of course I do, and I shall explain. The first thing to know is this map is truly astounding! Somehow this map contains radar like functions. It's so showing us the location of a crystal star! It looks like the first crystal star is to be found in a place called Petal Meadows. Petal Meadows? Pe petal. I said Petal Metal. <laughs> But the pedal to the metal. <laughs> yes, here is a vast meadow that lies far to the east of Rogueport. To tell you the truth, I've always thought that place was a tad suspicious. The name Petal Meadows did come up from time to time in my research. Okay, fine. So we'll go there. Does anybody know how to get there or what? I'm fairly certain that somewhere beneath the city is a pipe to Petal Meadows. You can just find that, you'd get there instantly. Pipe travel's efficient. Hey, wait a minute. That yeah. looks familiar. Yeah, he's just got that chilling <sighs> in his office. Say, by the way, Mario, how did you get that map anyway? It makes sense for him to have it. From Princess Peach, really? Your Highness sent this to you? It's Peach. It wouldn't be her, would it? <laughs> Front-facing Peach won't hurt so you. So it is her! Peach in Front facing Peach is not real. Front Your princess Peach came to see me the other day. She wanted to learn about their treasure. I told her about the crystal stars and my suspicions about Petal Meadows. Doesn't seem likely, but perhaps she tried to go to Petal Meadows on her own! That sounds like her. <sighs> you know, Professor, there was another suspicious group asking about the same thing. 
Hmm, but I can't imagine Princess Peach getting involved with them. Alright, it's settled. Off to Petal Meadows, you two go! Princess Peach, you run there. Your first priority must to be catch up to her. Collecting the stars is a means to an end, and that end is Princess Peach. Ain't that an understatement? It's a Mario game, after all. Aren't you coming, Professor? Nope! I'm gonna stay in town and ask around about Princess Peach and that suspicious gang. Besides, I doubt a shriveled old goomba like me can handle the trials of the road. It's probably for the best you come. I think you'll accidentally kill Vin if you, if you <laughs> came along. <laughs> of course, if anything happens, you need some advice. Come see me, okay? You got it, Professor. Well, Mario, we're off. Give it your best. Now then, allow me to give you both a proper farewell. Ah, Mario, there's something I forgot to mention. Firstly, about that light we saw shining on you. By my reckoning, Mario can now perform what is known as a special move. Yes. You now did... have a reason to use stylish moves now. He had the tilt a... towards the camera again. A special move? Yeah, it's, uh... Stuff like this is better explained by example rather than by words. Would you like to try? I guess. Yeah, this I actually want you to Excellent! In that do. case, let's give your special move a little test run. We have an audience! Oh, hey, All look right, at that. So, One, two, three, yeah, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, it says a number down there. Yeah, no, there, there's a number down there. I'll let you know how big your audience is. So, yeah. yes, we have our star power gauge now because we have a special move that we could do. Cool. Right there. One dot, okay. Yeah, that is a single unit of star power. I got it. Yes, so... star power available, you can use a special move. Try using Indeed. Sweet Treat now. It'll restore your HP and FP. Okay. And it is a very useful, very useful move. Even like, like halfway through the game, it's actually pretty damn useful. So, I recommend it. So, tilt to the left to throw the stars. Don't hit the boys and shrooms. Spam it. Spam it. Yeah. <laughs> And you heal some HP and FP. It is very, very useful. Okay. And you can see it depletes one unit of power. I see. And of course, like in the last Paper Mario game, there is a way to replenish it. Of course. Even if the gauge empties out, you can still charge it up again. That's why the audience watching your battles is very important. Yep. And in this game, we get our star power back by being hyped the dap the fuck up. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I'm not joking. <laughs> Attack me, please. And I want you to use one stylish move. Ah, Press you're direct back. right before Gumbella attacks. Press A. Thank you for resubscribing, Trim. How are you doing today? That is a stylish move. You get extra star points. Boom like that, the audience will feel ripped off. Trust me. Yeah, you have to execute your this. action commands. Don't get straight for right now. Yeah, and actually, like, do the... I fucked up the, the Goombilla action the actual, command. Yeah. I got the stylish, but I fucked up the command itself. Doing pretty good. Glad to hear it. Yep. Nice. Yeah, see that? You threw up your audience, so they filled up some of your gauge. Gotta fucked press up. A again. Oh, I lost people! Yeah, no, if you fuck up an fuck. action command. Um, less people will leave because the audience feels ripped off. So, if you cannot do an action command, I would just recommend just. If you cannot do a stylish command, I would just recommend focusing on the action command. Yeah. Because you can't be punished for not doing a stylish move. You can't be punished for not doing an action command yeah. properly, though. Yeah, I see that. Yeah, that's why I never really did Goombella's com action command because it's a little hard for me, the master. Okay, I get points anyway can... just because I did the action. Yes, you'll always get points as long as you do the action command properly. Okay. It's just that stylish moves are there so you get extra, you know, okay. energy for star points, for star power. I've played a little bit. I played up to the end of chapter one and that's all I've ever played. But I never really got a grasp on the stylish commands. So uh, she's making sure to explain it to me. She has, like... 
I've been playing unhealthily obsessed with this series. <laughs> <laughs> you can also use the appeal command to get star power. I hope you memorize all this. Okay. Fine work, Mario. Yay. And like I said, there is a way for us to safely learn about uh, stylish moves if you want. That is up to you. <laughs> Maybe later. It's it's dangerous to go alone. Go take alone. this. Take this. <laughs> How did I not know this? <laughs> Same brain Power cell. Smash. Delta badge, and it's incredibly helpful. But you played the first game, so I don't need to explain it to you. There are badges in this game. Yes. <laughs> now. I know how to equip badges. I'm good. I see. Okay. Have fun. Remember, you need a few to use them. Yeah, I got it. Please shut up. Oh, the joy of Nintendo tutorials. No. Let's go to badges. Let's equip that bad boy, because Power Smash actually is a Did great badge it? if you want to okay. grind for stylish moves. Oh, there's the way to learn them! Uh, hey there, kid. You got a minute to learn what it means to fight, like, with your whole heart? So, this guy is basically your training ground. So, you could talk to him and you could go into a sort of, like, semi-training battle, battle thing. And it, he, you basically can train on practically anything involving battle, including stylish moves. So, yeah, you, pr you can practice action commands. Okay. To defeat the Huns. Practice moves. Let's go. Begin. So there's going to be an A that hovers over you throughout like the entire animation of your attacks. Those are where you want to press A to get your stylish moves. You see? Oh, and you could press A again on the second jump so you can go higher and you could do the second stylish command. It's a lot, right? Yes. It, it, it takes a bit of practice. That's that's how I got go, good with action commands is I just went here and I like practiced for a little bit. So, I mean, you could do this on your own time if you want or not. Really, it's up to you. It's your playthrough. Um, but I recommend this if you want to actually learn about stylish moves and want to actually perfect perfect them to a degree. But yeah, it's nice that they set this up because this was absolutely not an option in the original game. So, it's cool that they set this up. Oh, by the way, there's also an action command for the actual... The uh, stylish move for the actual tattle ability as well. It's very easy. You just press A immediately after doing the action command. Yeah, it's very easy. Okay. I think I accidentally <laughs> did that once on its own. I never tattled that. I just realized. <laughs> Board. <laughs> it's a Goomba draw on the board. I think the master made this. He's surprisingly talented. It's unclear what the max HP is. No attack or defense either. This thing is sturdy though. It won't break no matter how hard you hit it, so don't hold anything back. Good to know. I never tattled that. Holy shit. <laughs> and of course, we only have Goombella right now. So yeah, those are your, that's your little training ground in case you ever want to like polish up on action commands or stylish moves. One is, okay. Yeah, and remember try to press A the second time because you'll go higher. It's hard. Like I said, it's like, um... It's like eighth no, so one and two and three and four. Oh, and you can press A like multiple times depending on the attack. A, A. Yep. Okay. And you can do even more for Power Smash as well. I love Power Smash because um, once you get the action command, it's great for grinding, um, grinding, uh, SP. 
It's really useful. There's four? Oh my god. Yeah, there's a lot. But like I said, if you get them all and you get the rhythm of it, it's really useful because it gives you a lot of, like, um, like star power to work with. I see that. And you do it either way, even if you fuck up the action command or not. Alright, I think I'm good. How do I end this? Stop. I'm good. Done for now. Appreciate the help, friend. Need anything else, kid? I'm I good. Think we're good. Give me some time to figure out some new secrets and we could come on back or whatever. Pew, pew, pew. We are going to pipe and we are going to the petal area. The the, the petal cherry blossom. Meadow, I think is what he called it. Yes, petal meadows. Uh perfect cherry blossom. <laughs> oh, no. this guy. My name is Dazzle and I collect star pieces. The more I collect that am. Oh, guy, if you got any star pieces, I'll trade you my badges for them. Which badge do you well, want to trade for? I don't for? have any yet. This is where we have, and there are quite a few useful ones. Um, quick change pisses me off because you need so much BP for that, and I use it because I love the Seven. Tattle. Jesus. Yes, quick change pisses me off! Uh, <sighs> I hate whoever made that decision. Hello. Welcome, Mario. I am more lovely, the lovely fortune teller. Seeing my amazing abilities, that which you seek is my humble job. The light of the shining stars will light that which I wish to see. <laughs> God damn, Cloud, you demon. Not in a <laughs> game rated E for everyone. <laughs> Maybe if it was rated T, but not in a game rated E for everyone. Cloud, you demon. So, shall I see something for you? And yes, it lets you know what you're supposed to do next in the game. Star pieces and shine sprites. I think I'm good for now. Yeah, no, I, I haven't had a need to use her, but I could see maybe when I would have to approach her on some things. The answer is not now. Well, yeah, not now. Oh yeah, I could go this way now. We can fly now. Fly me live, to I the moon. Fly. Outstanding. Anyways, let's go here where we have tentacle. It's kind of soggy and majorly gross. Bloop, bloop, bloop. <laughs> Ouch! That hurt. You stepped on his appendage. Bloop uh, bloop 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 bloop. Who just up and whack someone's tootsies like that? Bloop bloop bloop. Somebody with serious moxie, that's who. Bloop bloop bloop. Would you look at that? It's some saucy mustache guy. Saucy? He's in a world of hurt. Sauce. I never knew. <laughs> bloop, 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 bloop. I'll give him a taste of the old tentacle trample. Tentacle trample sounds like a goddamn category in a hentai. Please don't ever say that again. Hey, Mario, you told us what Professor Frankly told us. You remember what Professor Frankly told us, right? Goomba, uh, not now. <laughs> I don't know why they told. I, I don't know why they have that set of dialogue set up, but sure. Saucy. Oh no, not saucy. I don't want your Alfredo sauce, bro. <sighs> and a really super humongous one, too. Ew, it's all slimy. I just totally can't stand the slimy, nasty, icky game. I icky things. G-R-O-S-S, -S, gross. 
you're gonna clip that, and I hate you all for it. <laughs> Thank you Max, for the rage, Patrick. What a it's what a time. <laughs> no. So what? So what? Those guys are way out of my league. I can't beat them. It's hopeless. I understand that now. You bloody ah! idiot! Hoots, yeah? Thank you for the rate, Patrick. <laughs> oh. No, not my slimy, icky, gross comment. Oh, Christ. Of course that's one Patrick rated, too. That's the best part about it. <laughs> I hate you all. <laughs> <laughs> how you doing? How, how was uh, uh, Mario Galaxy today, Patrick? Did you get the power stars? Once you damage both its tentacles, it'll fall down, and that's when it's attack time. By the way, the tentacles have three HP each. Now relax and make seafood out of that slimy, nasty blooper. It was fine, nice and quiet stream. Okay. Bloop, bloop. A hey, mustache. Bloop, 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 bloop. You thinking I taste good, aren't you? Admit it. Bloop, 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 bloop. Yeah, you want to snack on these tentacles, don't you? <laughs> that is not my fetish, sir. You're talking Excuse blooping. Excuse me? <laughs> Blue. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, no, some acting commands are harder than, you know, others. That's why I said, you know, be careful when using a super guard, because... Sometimes you might get a little bit more than you bargained for. I fucked up the action, man. Damn it. If I had to choose between fucking up a super guard and getting the regular guard, I would rather get the regular guard. Yeah, exactly. That's what I said. Be careful when you use a super guard. Like I said, I, I had to learn that the hard way. Oh, you are... you are... warming! Much like the bird that dive bombed the hood of Jordan's car. <laughs> <laughs> oh Christ! That's not an exaggeration. That happened during the trip. No, I believe you. <laughs> that's um, that's why I feel so bewildered. Jesus. Patrick could did tell it you. Want it, did it want to see its own end? Apparently. <laughs> Shit! Oh my God! Save that bird. You can't super guard every attack in this game. Why you would... Sir, this is my first real playthrough. You know exactly what you're getting him in for. Listen, y'all talking mad shit until you have like an attack that could take away half your HP instantly. And then you're like, damn, maybe a super guard ain't worth it. Hmm. <laughs> This thing gave 20 star points, which is nice. So much more. Why the fuck did that first fight not give 10? Because it was your I first fight. Don't understand it. <laughs> it it makes no fight. sense. Because fucking Lord, Lord Crump is a fucking beta cuck, that's why. <laughs> bloop, bloop. Okay. I don't think he wanted to translate that. I think he was cursing us out. I was waiting for Gumbala Bella to fall in that water. I was gonna laugh. <laughs> it would have been funny. <laughs> Chapter 1! Castle and Dragon. Castle and Dragon. Castles and Dragons. The, the popular tabletop game in the Mushroom Kingdom. So, we're just playing Dungeons and Dragons, right? Yeah, sure, let's go with that. Grassland. Well, here we are! The Petal Meadows, where folks say a Crystal Star hides. Cool. Woohoo! Here we go, Mario! This is the start of our adventure! This is completely awesome! You only want to save, that's probably the smart thing. Depth perception, please! <laughs> <laughs> Vincent, the shadow was there. Oh, oh yeah. Also, you can hammer the grass. Interesting. Oh, 
You should do that. And the trees. Also, that was a shadow. That was a dragon. Shadow that was dragon. a whole ass dragon. That was, it sure was. Paper mache dragon. Oh dear. Yeah, well, oh. it's Paper Mario. That makes sense. Whoa, what was that? I've never seen anything that humongous before. It looked kind of scary, too. It definitely flew into the castle back there, right? Let's get going in case it comes back. Here we go, again! As a matter of fact, I think I'm just gonna go home. <laughs> Imagine. I didn't sign up for this shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure Peach is fine. Peach will be fine. <laughs> Oh, that's what's going on. So yeah, you can hammer the grass and the trees. I recommend doing that because... Well, I could spend hours doing this. I hope you know. It's okay. Look, I've been spending hours doing this on my own time, so I wouldn't blame you. Aha! Peace. Awesome. True. We finally have items now! <laughs> Well, I had a mushroom at one point, and then I used it. Yeah. So this is, like, a warp pipe, right? That we have to, like, unlock or something? Probably like with these star- like or sun and moon shaped things. Poke we have to play Pokemon Sun and Moon to activate the warp pipe. Well, conveniently, <laughs> I did just pick up a copy of Sun and Moon. So <laughs> let's go. Where's my DS? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Mushroom. Oh, you can also hammer those grasses back there as well, like bushes, like bushes and trees you could hammer. Yeah, if it's got a, like an animal crossing stand, like then you can hammer it. Wait your turn, sir. Yeah, you can't hammer, you can't hammer those candy cane looking things, but... You can hammer, like, the small patches of grass and, like, the trees and, like, the bushes. You can hammer those, too. That is overkill. <laughs> I was trying to do the stylish, but I missed, uh, I fucked it up. I pressed it too late, I think. Uh, takes practice. Close call. Hmm, oh. that seems like Useful. something I should equip immediately. That has actually saved my life, so yes, I would. I would do the same thing. Okay. Almost to a level up. We're almost at level two. <laughs> Yay! That is good news. It will always be good news. Pipe. We can't get that! <laughs> Jabated! Oh, fuck. No! <laughs> oh, dear. Owie. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> it gave you an owie. That's okay. That's why we have stylish moves. We could get our clout back. You don't blame me. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse you! <laughs> you must be a more toxic girlfriend. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Apparently. I need chat to make up for my lack of being a toxic girlfriend. <laughs> Something like that. Chat, it's okay to catch me slipping. Please make up for my lack of toxicity. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> One more thing, Mario. If you ever find yourself wondering what to do, just press ZLX for a hint. We already had that tutorial yeah, game. Say, that's that uh, we, we can't. I don't know anyone over that in Rogue Park game. <laughs> oh, Nintendo tutorials. God, you are so. Oh, it's at sometimes. its worst in Pokemon Sun and Moon, by the way. <laughs> oh shit! Like half the game's runtime is tutorial. Ew! Why? Because 
they want it to be very handholdy because it's a game for kids or something. I know, but like kids can figure shit out. You're acting like they're they're they're, they're like pea brains, bro. I I I, I know. very annoying. <laughs> 96. It's the opposite of 69. Here's a stupid question. <laughs> can, can the audience like throw things at us or something? You didn't have to figure that out so quickly. I feel I like, guess. I mean, we were just talking about being uh, toxic. I feel like that's a toxic thing to do as an audience member. <laughs> Also, Trim, we know you have a pea brain. <laughs> well, I funny mean, that you say that, it is a thing in the game. Um, you lovely. will get shit thrown at you. Um, but here's the thing, though. Uh, be careful, because there are some items that you want that the audience members can toss at you, and also they'll just throw garbage at you. You have to check to make sure what exactly they're throwing at you. Uh-huh. Yeah, and it's also, like, at the moment, at, like, like the snap of a moment, so, um... Yeah, you have to really look and see what's going on. And if they're if they're throwing an item, you can leave it be. If they're throwing like rocks or shit at you, then yeah, you can. Something tells get me I'm gonna them. be taking a lot of damage from the audience. <laughs> it, it's hard to. I fucked up the first time. Like I saw that as well. Um, it, wait a minute. Getting used to, but you'll get the rhythm to it. Boombella's not here with me. <laughs> She's just stuck. Fire flower, useful. Always. All right. Last game, it was fuzzies. What's the problem with this town? Bird. Oh. I didn't know we were playing Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire. <laughs> Welcome, travelers. Okay. Hmm, <laughs> where you ask? Why, this is Spittleberg. Sorry, Professor but it's a, been a long you time so since we've had visitors. <laughs> Yippity! <laughs> Once that dragon hooktail was spotted flying around this area. Well, it didn't help tourism, put it that way. People just stopped visiting. Dragon? Hooktail? That must have been that huge thing we saw earlier, Mario. So it's called Hooktail, huh? Ooh, scary name. By the way, Green Boots, have you heard of these things called Crystal Stars? We're on this quest for them. Very important. Mm, crystal Stars, you say? Hmm, nope, can't say I have. Sorry about that. You may want to speak with the mayor, though. He's old. Really old. Really, really old. As such, he knows all kinds of stuff. Koopas of his age are, um, really smart. And stubborn. Anyway, the mayor lives in that pink house up ahead. A pink house? Sounds totally hideous, but it should be easy to find. Thanks for your help. All right, let's go. Need to judge Gumbella, goddamn. <laughs> Hi. Hmm. I am General White. I am a bum bum, and I have lost my hopes and dreams. I live in solitude always. I must apologize, but I ask that you leave me alone. Depression is a hell of a drug. But I'm General Wade, I am a ba bum and I have lost my hopes and dreams. I live in solitude I always. Okay, he doesn't have any other dialogue. Yeah. He's just a depressed man. What the fuck are you? Go talk to him. <laughs> oh, bonjour, mademoiselle. Isn't it a beautiful day? No, 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 not you, Monsieur de la Moustache. I am speaking to the lovely little cabbage behind you, mon petit chou. Do you hear me, beautiful? Abandon this dollar and come away with me. Sir? Ew, are you kidding me? Ew, nice wig, you disco wannabe. Take a high bozo to jump. Oh, je suis blessé. I am indeed such brutal honesty, such a sharp tongue. Bro, you're a masochist. I shall retreat for now. If you change your mind, come find me. I didn't know Nikhil was in this game. Oh, what total sleaze. Let's go somewhere else, Mario. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Uh, oh my god. Hi. This village is very nice. Clear water, clean air, absolutely delicious. But there's foul Hooktail, she's made- Oh, Hooktail's a girl. She's made everyone yeah. forget their fortunes, how sad. That seems like an important character. <laughs> and there's our pink house. Oh, by the way, those, uh, there's a garden there. There's a garden. Garden? Hammer. Nope, nope. Left, 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 left. Nope, go down. Go. There's an opening. There's an open. Nope, no, nope, no. Nope. Other way, other way. Go up. <laughs> Against the wall. Aha. Nice. It's a turtley bush plant. You can only get one. You have to leave the screen and go back for more. Okay. Put those in storage. They're going to be useful later. Hello. <sighs> Not again. I'll do, uh, you want me to? You want? To... <sighs> what is that? Someone there? Who is it? You? What do you want from me? I know you're thieves. Here to rob a defenseless old Koopa. Despicable. Sir? Go on, do what you will, but as you can plainly see, there's nothing to steal here. Oh, I guess I have a little money. Take your beans in my antique shell, too. Do not disrobe in front of me. I will have a stroke. Just leave the photos of me and the missus. Can't do it without those memories. Well, shit, this got sad. What? Not thieves, you say? That's what I've been trying to tell you. <laughs> well, what's your story, then? Oh, wait. You folks are looking for the crystal stars? Well, why didn't you pipe up before you? And gee, we're wasting time here, sir. The crystal stars you say you're hunting? Er, uh, wait. I hear about those dang things again. Aha! Uh -huh. Got it! Hooktail! Hooktail's got what you're looking for! Ah, uh, crap baskets. <laughs> He's this enormous, ordinary dragon. Eats folks, they say. You know Hooktail, right? Yeah, of course. Oh, well, this Hooktail's brutal fly-by snackings have all of us on pins and needles. So, are you reckless fools? I mean, are you galleon heroes off to rough her up? You got it. Oh, oh this sounds Promising! Why, if you can rid us of Hooktail, we'll shower you with gratitude and reward! Wait, what's that I hear? Y'all accept no rewards? Sir, when did we say that? I didn't say that! But, yeah, <laughs> of course I won't. I just need the Crystal Star. And my girlfriend. <laughs> what an unselfish man! You're noble indeed! Yup, a good egg! Now, what did you say your name was again? It's me, Mario. <laughs> Murphy? Huh, that's a fine name. Yes, a fine name indeed. Well now, Murphy. It's Mario. I appreciate that, Murphy. They're nice eyebrows. Now, Not like these. <laughs> <laughs> If you're intent on going to Hooktail Castle, find the secret pipe that's located somewhere in Petal Meadows. Not that much of a fucking secret. You just need Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon to use that pipe. The stones are somewhere in Sh Shwunk Fortress. Just past the village, get them first. All right. Well then, Murphy, get going and really wallop that hook tail monster. Sure, I guess. That's tear voice acting, anyways. <laughs> oh fuck, we should have done something in Rogueport, I just realized. What? Oh god, I, I don't know what's gonna happen if we didn't do it now, but like, we have to wait like a chapter's worth for something, for a service that I really think we should have prepared. <laughs> 
Should we go back and do that then? I, I, I guess so, just to be safe. All right. Fuck, I completely forgot about that thing. At least I remembered it now. Better late than never. Yeah, just save for now, and we'll just backtrack a little to to fucking Rogueport for a moment. Oh my god, you do not explore, like, at all. You just go straight through the game, huh? Because, like, when I, like, booted up the game, I went, like, everywhere. Like, I was going, like, as far as I possibly could, as I possibly could, like, when I first showed up in Rogueport. That's why, like, I didn't even think about it until just now. Yeah... I was doing so well in practice with her action, or with her stylish command. It's always different when the real thing comes, it's fine. Finally got that level up. Level up! Pick your poison. PP. Easily the most useful thing right now. Nice. I say as if I have more than two badges, but you know what I mean. We'll get more. Trust me, we'll get more. And if you're like me, you're definitely gonna need a lot of PP. Pardon me. Wait your turn. Coming through. Yeah, let's go to Rogueport really quick. And we're gonna go up to the surface. So, so, uh, Luna, when you're editing this. Just cut when we leave the village and come back when we're going up the pipe into Rogueport. Yes, please and thank you. Although there, I don't know if there might be parts that you want want to see, because there only is dialogue I, like, that we have to see. <laughs> only if I like die in Rogueport, or uh, on the way to Rogueport, or back from Rogueport. Those are the, the only things the that would be worth. Parts. Keep the interesting parts. I would assume. Well, that's why I said when we go up this pipe. All right, so what are we here for? Yeah, so go, go west. West? I thought you said west. <laughs> go west, good sir. How far west? Continue going west. Freeze! Okay. You two, not another step. Don't come this way. Why? Did you, like, drop a contact or something? Because that would be a Nintendo roadblock. Some complete jerk just bumped into me and made me lose a contact lens. <laughs> I hate that. Uh... That is so uncanny. <laughs> <laughs> Nintendo does this shit too much if I was able to guess that. Listen, all they did was remake the game. They didn't change that much. <laughs> I never did this when I played. <laughs> yeah, well, this game's like fucking like 20 years old. I only played one chapter and I didn't ever come back to Rogueport. I was still in Petal, Petal Meadows when I stopped playing. <laughs> Loud hush your mouth. Oh, dear. Uh, God fucking damn. Look, it's still a better excuse than, um, the guy who was investigating special Pokemon footprints, and it turns out it was his own. What? Yeah. I forgot what human feet look like. In, uh, Ruby and Sapphire, that is a genuine roadblock that you encounter early on in the game. <laughs> I am looking for it right now, so don't you dare move! 
You hear me? Whatever you do, do not move an inch. Not an inch, you hear? <laughs> Vin's intrusive thoughts are failing. Are, are winning. Why? Because <laughs> you're just... I can see it in your face. It's like, what if I just moved like a step? <laughs> One step is all it takes. <laughs> your intrusive... I see it in your face. Your intrusive thoughts are winning. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. What if we just like moved back a smidge? I mean, she told us to freeze. I mean, we can't possibly, so if we could just like walk back. Is it possible fine. to just wait here long enough and she'll find it? Just walk back. <laughs> hey, you told us not to move another inch, okay? We we figured it was inch forward. Ugh! Idiot! You stepped on it, my poor contact lens! I told you not to move! Don't your stupid ears work with what you're thinking! This is your fault! Now I have to buy a new contact lens and you're paying for it! Compensate me, Mr. Clumsy! Fine, if that's your plan, then here is mine, you oaf! I'm going to block the gate to the west side until you bring me a new contact lens. Yo, I I'm worried we would have had to deal with this like after chapter one and not before it. <laughs> you can hammer her all you want, but she's a stubborn bitch, so she's not moving. <laughs> but there is a solution. Bring her a contact lens. Go to the shop. <laughs> It's the Toad Brothers Bazaar. Talk to the guy. <laughs> welcome. Yes, welcome to the Toad Brothers Bazaar. Mm. Eh, what's that? You want a contact lens, you say? Mm, wait just a moment. I set her on fire. I would, Cloud, if it would let me. <laughs> I know you would. <laughs> well, gee, fella, I'm sorry, but we don't have any stock in right now. Tough luck, I know. Yeah, special order one right away for you, but it'll take a while. Check back soon, okay? AKA one chapter's worth. That's why I want this done now. <laughs> Annoying. But fine. All right. At least I assume it's one chapter's worth. I don't know if they fix that in this game, but I'd rather not test it. So that's why. Either I way, back we'll meet you back at Petal Meadows. Yay. Or more specifically, the village. You. I don't know what that accent was. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Everybody here it seems to have a unique accent, so... It's a rogue port, okay? You're not born here. Everyone just comes here. Oh, <laughs> you did like a U... a U dive. Now to get Pokemon Sun and Moon. <laughs> so there are actually items in Pokemon called the Sun and Moon Stone. We're going to get Pokemon Sun and Moon. <laughs> and what they do is that they evolve different Pokemon. Nice. Uh. I think that guy's pathing just didn't know how bridges work. <laughs> anyway, we're back at Petalburg. Alright, so do you want to get more items? Because I don't know how many we have, and I think you might want... Actually, yeah, there's one thing I do want you to get. I think we're okay on items for now. Let's get one thing just to be safe. What's that? If you don't mind. So go to the shop. It's just for safety, mostly. Get a POW block. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, let me give you the explanation of the shop points. 
So yeah, you get one point, everything you shop goes high as 300, and there is a paper over there on that on the very right that tells you what points you get, what prices you get, for depending on the points you get. Need to hear it yeah. again? No, I'm good. <laughs> so yeah, just get one power block. Okay. And yeah, that paper over there lets you know what you get. Okay. So the more I buy, the more points I get. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. I can work with that. Alright. Now let's go, because we have a Schwonk Fortress to, to, to invade, I guess. I don't know. We have a fortress to Schwonk. I'm actually worried since the old guy might kill me. Anyway. Why are you here? <laughs> Oh yeah, he's here in every major town, essentially. Okay. Yeah, it's always there, so you don't have to go to Rogueport every time you want to practice. Some stone monsters live in Shawunk Fortress up ahead. Or so we fear. Skate is here to keep him out. But if Mare says it's okay, I'll let you pass. Careful out there, though. Um, excuse me. Uh, I beg your pardon. Wait a moment, please. S tier voice. Uh, pardon me for yelling like that. I was panicking. Um, how to begin? M my name's Coops. I heard you're traveling to Hooktail's castle. I, uh, I have a favor to ask. Um... Oh, just, just forget it. Never mind. Ignore me. Good, goodbye. Okay, that was weird. What do you think was going on inside that guy's shell? Great question. Something tells me that we're gonna want to go find him. Rose got social anxiety. You are can't imp blame him. important, so I'm gonna guess he's this house. Oh, look, I... Listen, just forget the whole scene I made earlier, okay? It was nothing. We're just fooling around with something. Okay. Mans is staring out the window at this girl. I don't know why he's doing that. He doesn't need to. Like, look where he's positioned, <laughs> and look where the window is compared to her. He is staring you out can, the window at her. You can talk to her if you want. I guess I should. Hey, you know that guy in there is staring at you, right? Oh, well, hello there. My name's Kubiko. It's nice to meet you. Oh my gosh, that hat, those overalls, and and that magnificent mustache? You're Mario, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> For tales of how strong you are. If you're here, then that means you're going to challenge that monstrous hook tail? Oh, if only Coops were as brave as you. <laughs> so they do know each other. Yeah. That makes it even creepier that he's staring out the window at her. What the fuck? <laughs> e for everyone. <laughs> Should I tell him? <laughs> I'm surprised that that landed. Yeah, they're very forgiving with first strikes in this game. Koopa. That's a Koopa Troopa. They've been around forever. Gotta respect the longevity. Max HP 4, attack 2, defense 1. Their shells are hard, but flip them over and their defense drops to 0. And you know how to flip them over, right? Yep. Jumps and pow blocks, so just get in there and start stomping. I get why you want me to grab a pow block now. Actually, that's not the reason why, but it is there. If you so need it. Uh huh. I feel a lot more comfortable having Mario in front. Yeah. Uh, like I said, I did make the mistake of having my partner out, and, um... Uh, it didn't end well. Did he have no pants on? Do Koopas it's, it's even wear Koopa pants? 
Then no, they don't typically. <laughs> oh. Touch fuzzy, get dizzy. Oh no, it's just a Koopa. I was pissing in the bush. <laughs> I mean, for all we know, that could be what was happening. <laughs> yeah. What just do you mean I can't us. flee this fight? <laughs> just, just fighting us with his goddamn wiener slapping around. <laughs> oh god, that'd be terrible. That's a mental image I did not need right now. Thanks. Anyway, this is Hands. audience thing. That guy's got a rock. No way. He isn't going to throw it at you. You'll get hurt if the audience hits you with anything. <laughs> not just emotionally. <laughs> Unless they're throwing tomatoes. In which case, yeah. Press X. Yes, the audience will throw rocks or garbage at you. You do not want that. Um, there are items that they will throw at you and leave them alone if they do so. <laughs> yeah, there might be actual fans that are throwing gifts at us. You can Kay. leave those alone. Attack with your hammer. Oh, I only got the one. Get fucked! <laughs> nice. Your attacks will cause the backdrop to collapse, and it could drop on us too, so watch out. Outstanding. All sorts of other things could happen while we're up here, so stay alert and try to come out on top. I could have super guarded that and just ended him there. I don't have the water in here, damn it, Cloud! <laughs> Why don't you have the water in here? That's like a requirement for your Sipping through my Kirby container. <sighs> Why don't I have the water in here? It's because I finished the gallon. I bought a new gallon last night and forgot to put it in here. <laughs> I was worried that would happen, too, when I <laughs> started streaming. I was like, fuck, it's too late. I can't go get it now. Let's just hope it doesn't show up. But I forgot Cloud is here, and he will play it every stream without fail. <sighs> Thank you for the redeem, Cloud. Oh, you see, you did the, you did the higher jump. The second higher jump. You could do it a stylish move there. Because that is a waste of time. <clears throat> so what are those, like, cards in the top right corner? Uh, or does that not slots. matter yet? Slots. Slots. Yeah. Be prepared for some slots if you get two in a row. Um, depending on the image that you line up, you will get different effects, and usually they are all positive. Just don't get the three poison mushrooms. That almost fucked me over. Can I super guard that? Yes, you can. Technically, you, you could super guard almost any attack, I'd say. But like I said, just uh, be careful, because some attacks are not worth super guarding. Hmm. Hey, another one. Another one. Okay, good. I, I, I forgot if it, I didn't know if it was in a tree 
or bush or somewhere else. So just in case we miss it, <laughs> I got I got the extra one for you. Mm -hmm. Oh, this looks this, this fortress looks very schwankable. Oh. Hello, jackass. I don't know why you left, little homie. That wasn't our fault. <laughs> we didn't know the defense. What happened? Nothing an audience member left after that, but <laughs> I was just say like, dang, you're gonna get mad at us for that? That's a bald clef. Basically a rock monster with a sharp, craggy face. Uh, this is kind of mean, but bald guys really just don't do it for me. Wow. Man, is that necessary? HP 2, attack 1, defense 2. Yeah, this guy is rock solid. Fire doesn't even hurt it. It might be best to attack with, say, a power block. Uh-huh. I understand. Yeah. However, power smash. We were trying to find a person's blood type while he was bleeding out, but he just kept shouting to be positive. Okay. Cloud... That's such a bad joke, Cloud. It's some wild dark humor. I got almost all of those. Yeah, no, you did. Like I said, power, like, uh, the power smash is very good for, like, getting stylish moves in. Uh oh. Okay, maybe that's not uh oh. You must fill the toad troll while he's not here. Good grief. Uh, do you though? Nice try, idiot! Nice. Hmm. I hate that he takes an extra turn just because he has an even number of health, but takes an, an odd number of hits. Eh. It's just a way to make things more tedious, I guess. I guess. Money. Excuse you. Okay. Those look safe. Oh no. You might be wondering what those are. And the answer is. A pain the in my why, ass. The reason why I wanted you to get a power block. It's a bristle. They're totally covered in spikes. They're so prickly. Max HP 2, attack 1, and defense 4. And they're impervious to fire. Even trying to get close enough to whack it with a hammer is dangerous. Seriously, its spikes will totally pop out. So since you can't jump on it or use your hammer, you better use an item. I see. Like I said, I oh didn't know where the field power block did. was. So, <laughs> Nani? So yeah, that's why I told you to get one, just in case we don't find it out in the field. Yeah. But it turns out I was in a block anyway, so. Game design! Next. <laughs> An 
ending coupon, a free nice. pass. Sure. It means there's probably a boss right here. <laughs> Although there, there should be a save block if there's a boss. I feel, but you know, whatever. I mean, oh, yeah, speak of the devil. Yep. <clears throat> it's a funky looking statue. <laughs> You're the first contestant I've had in a while. You want the center moonstones? If that's the case, then you must compete against me. You win, I'll let you through where the stones rest. Whatever. Lose. And you, oh no, a terrible fate. You've met with a terrible fate, haven't you? <laughs> what do you say? <laughs> well said. You're in for it now. <laughs> uh oh. Oh. Hey, 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 it's that time again. Welcome everyone to the 65th Trivia Quiz Off. What happened to Mr. Hammer? He was the last. If you correctly host. answer five of the following questions, you'll win. You get three wrong, and you'll suffer. No, thought I do not want no. to play a game. What's I don't want to be locked into a hell bathroom. Sun and Moon sounds. Easy. That's correct. Too easy. Gets harder from here. Much harder. Prepare yourself. Yeah, this is a bitch question. Uh, okay. Hi. Mush. Mushroom is like three. Fire flower is like five, I think. I think. Unless they're both Unless five. Much? No, I don't think they're both five. We would have noticed. So then, yeah, it's got to be like three and five. Because they're cheap. They're very inexpensive. I think you might be right. Uh, I'm not sure, but that's what we're going with. Fuck! No, damn it. I still don't remember that, and I already <laughs> played through this chapter. Shit! It's fine, we'll be fine. Do you not know? I didn't investigate. Down, down. No, 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 no. Yeah. It's Koopa Coot. Because he did introduce no. himself. No, it's not! <laughs> Do you want me to help you before you... Because I don't know what happens if you, if you fuck this up. I have to get three wrong to fail anyway. I swear <laughs> it's Koopa Coot, though. Did he not introduce himself as Koopa Coot? I swear to God, he did. Go, girl, shut the fuck up! <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> I hate that it doesn't loop and I would have to scroll all the way up or down. Let Vinny answer. <laughs> I mean, okay, but like, if he fucks up, I don't know what's gonna, what we're gonna be dealing with, so... A boss fight, probably. <laughs> probably. Look, Tail Castle. I know that one for sure. Go, go through a pipe? What? Y y yeah? That's how I got here. How many questions are there? Oh my god. Seven, I think. Oh. Koopa 
troop. Let's... Super question 64! <laughs> <laughs> I wish I wasn't on uh, my final uh, incorrect because that would I would have loved to be able to answer that. <laughs> <laughs> yes. How did your brain go to Koopa Koot? I don't get it. <laughs> I swear to God that he introduced himself as Koopa Koot. No, that was in 64. Uh... Hello, warp pipe. This is why I'm here. <laughs> I don't think it's a good idea for paper to be in water. I'm just saying, oh, fuck off. What if the water's also paper? <laughs> hey, you wanted. Hey, listen. You wanted fuzzies? We got fuzzies. God damn it. That's a fuzzy. What a sniper little guy, huh? Cut back on the caffeine. Hey, don't call me out. HP 3, attack 1, and defense 0. Those things suck up your HP and use it to replenish their own. Isn't that the worst? I mean, ew! Doesn't that totally just sound gross? Anyway, sounds like you need to use the guard action command when you, they release you. The timing's pretty hard to master, so uh, practice up. These guys really suck. HP. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, yay, ads. Or, uh, bots. Is the HP suck their only move? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, why is he trying to suck me at full health? <laughs> um, excellent question. <laughs> I know what I said. Did I stutter? Did I stutter? Yeah, no, um, yeah, no, that's the only move these guys have, as far as I'm concerned. We got Pokemon Moon! They tried to give me the suck. Yeah, and I'm <laughs> not happy about it. The Max Suk. That is a lot of guys. I'm not going to waste the time taking them out one by you. one. <laughs> I don't blame you. How did a bunch of fuzzies give me more <laughs> star points don't listen. than the mini listen. boss? Don't complain. <laughs> it's 12. Hush. I'm just saying, there are so many fights that shouldn't give more than 10, that give more than 10, and then the mini-boss at the start of the game didn't. Look, it's fine, okay? Multi-bounce! Yeah, you jump, and then you can jump on a bunch of enemies in a row, essentially is what that is. Can be useful. Of 
Remember what we learned? There we go. I don't even recognize that item, though. Okay, uh, let's see if they drop it in the field, because sometimes they do that. One day I'll learn the action, or the timing of that. Yeah, it, it is a little hard to learn. <laughs> okay. Yep. HP it's drain. An HP drain. Does five damage oh. to a foe while replenishing your HP by five. So against the fuzzy, it's an insta kill. Yes. Which, uh... Not perfect. We got Pokemon Sun! Is it worth it? Worth what? Uh, I'll figure it out later. Firefly rhythm. I was I was wondering, is it worth it to do the um the multi bounce to practice the uh, stylish command on that? And I was like, yeah, don't worry about it now. I'll worry about it later. I don't even remember what the stylish command for that is. Yeah, rumor says that Mario took a fuzzy in after the adventure was over. I have he my named doubts. Him Cletus, it's his pet. <laughs> Imagine owning a fuzzy as a pet. What would you feed it? Well, it, they're vampire. Oh no! What are you? I was gonna say, give it blood. Meow. Hey, you suspicious types! This is our place. Coming in here is road, road, road. Sorry, suckers. If you want a warm welcome, too bad. Now I lunch on your head. See, they're vampires. <laughs> Listen. We could just find <laughs> just find the nearest small animal. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Listen, just 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 draw your blood. It's fine. This is a boss fight. It's not going to die in one hit. No, it won't. No, I said tattle. That's a gold fuzzy. Whoa, those are super rare. I'm serious. Wow. HP 10, attack 1, and defense 0. But hey, even though it's a fuzzy, it won't suck up your HP, which is nice. Good. I have to wonder, though, how does this thing hide? Look at it. It's so gaudy. It may not be able to do that, but uh, it can summon a lot of fuzzies. So, uh, be careful. Uh-huh. <laughs> Instantly switched to power smash. Yay! Full combo. Meow. Hey. Ow. You chumps are tougher than you look. But I'm not through yet. Everyone, get him! I beg your fucking pardon? <laughs> None <of> the fuck. <laughs> you can tattle those, by the way. <laughs> if you're damn curious. <laughs> if you're curious. God fucking damn it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fuzzy horde. Look at them all. What a mob team. The fuzz is a buzz. HP 20, attack 1, and defense is 0. Fuzzies come at you all at once and attack in order. It says here to not freak out. It also says to use good timing to defend. You won't take much damage. That, that is very true. You, you, you're gonna have to practice a little. Thinking it might just be faster to whip the ringleader, though, you know? And she is not kidding. Focus on the gold fuzzy. <laughs> hey. 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 Let's go! Eat a mushroom, my god. Or something. 
Or HP drain. That works too. Yeah, sure. Skedaddle. Now, if I did kill the Fuzzy Horde, how many star points would I have gotten? Um. Well, I just recently went into a fight where, like, I fought, like, extra. There was extra guys along with the main guy, and I didn't get any star points for killing, like, one of the extra guys, so. I'm gonna assume if they do drop star points, not as much as the gold fuzzy. But that's just what I think. I, I don't know. I'm making an educated guess here. Alright, pick your poison. Understandable. I had to really think about that one, though. Because I was like, well, what do I want most? I could use more HP, but I've not been suffering for HP, and I've been doing okay with uh, action commands for guarding. So I'm like, it's not mm. that pressing to raise HP right now. And then okay. I was like, okay, but BP or FP? And then I was like, well, I haven't been getting many badges, so I am not super hurting for BP just yet. But I can increase the number of power smashes that I can do if I increase my FP. All right. You got me. The hell out of here, you goddamn fucking menaces. Yep. Let's -a go. <laughs> Just trying to picture Mario having a pet fuzzy. I need to complete this! <laughs> Sounds like you got an email, Mario. What do you Open mean it. I got an email? Open it, you won't. <laughs> you can also check your email under the mailbox XP in the menu if you want. Some folks just like menus, you know? Hello, Mario. Working hard? <laughs> Professor Frankly here in e-form. It's highly likely you'll receive emails like this one while you're on your journey, so check your mail often. You I actually have nothing more to say. That. Uh, than that, so I hope all goes well for you, and I look forward to see getting more information on those crystal stars, Professor Frankly. It'll let you know when you got the email. <laughs> I just gotta level up, I don't know why. Thankfully, you did not just waste five coins, which is good. I don't know if I'm more patient than you, but I'm like the type of person who like fights through every enemy. But that's just me. It's fine. No, I mean, it's your playthrough. Do what you want. Yeah, if I don't if I don't have to kill a thing, I'd rather not kill a thing. Because that Fair. at that point just feels like a waste of time. And then when I'm inevitably under leveled, that's when I'll start killing things. <laughs> Come again. Dear Mr. Mario, thank you for registering with the Rogueport Direct Mail Service. Your kind friend, Mr. Frankly, referred to referred you to us. Our direct mail service will provide you with regular timely news updates. We hope you enjoy our service. <sighs> Frankly just gave us spam mail. <laughs> yes, yes he did. <laughs> Hey, I got the things. Well done there, Murphy. You found a sunstone and a moonstone, have you? Excellent work. Next, you'll find a secret pipe that leads to Hooktail Castle. So shake a leg, Murphy. Go show that Hooktail creature who's boss. Okay. <sighs> oh, I'm General White. I am a bomb. -bom. I've lost my hopes and dreams. My heart has grown cold. I must apologize. Did I? But I ask that you leave me alone. Can I just say I really appreciate that? Like the NPCs have like such emotive like sprites when they talk this time. Hi. 
Most flowers keep their tongues still, but make no mistake, they understand us. Which is why I ask that you always speak kindly to our floral friends, do you? They know what you speak. <laughs> That's not creepy. Um, sir? Sir? Hi. <laughs> Ba ba pira ba ba pira ba 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 pira. We share one brain cell. <laughs> All right, let's go. Oh God, I already forgot the voice I gave him. Uh, uh it it's Mario, right? Look, I um. See, the thing is, I've been waiting here in the hope to get in and speak with you. Um, see, I was wondering. Would you... Oh, please take me with you to Flight Hooktail, please, I'm begging you! Sorry about that. See, my dad, he went off to Battle Hooktail long ago, but he never came back. I miss him, of course, I miss him badly, but this isn't just about avenging my dad. Well, no, that's not true. Revenge is part of it, I guess. A big part. But the truth is, I want to finish what dad started, for his sake, for everyone's sake. Tell me the truth now, Coops. <laughs> I man, this is embarrassing. See, <laughs> everyone always says I'm a quiet baby, a weakling. But if I could defeat Hooktail, well, I won't be those things. I'll be strong like my dad. I know it will be dangerous, but I still want to <laughs> go. Please, Mario. Sure. Coop, Coops is my favorite Uwu character. For real? No kidding? Yes, thank you so much. You won't forget this. Alright, cool. We got Coops. Shell. His ability is shell. Yes. Although his shell is a little more fancy compared to the original. But yes, you can do shell things as you would. However, if you hold X... I see. He stays! Interesting. Mario can move around while keeping Koops in place and he can press the switch from a distance! Whoa! 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 It won't let me jump. <laughs> I was gonna try to press the switch as Mario, but fine. <laughs> it disables your jump and hammer. Well, you could do all that stuff. They just wanted you to walk around. Yeah, I know. And of course, you have Shell Toss and Power Shell, because Koopa enemy, or Koopa yes. ally. Okay, Mario, let's get going. Oh, god damn it. Oh. What now? Oh, golly, uh, hi. Hi, Koopy, Koopy Koo. Did, did you overhear all that? Well, Fit Koops, I thought I heard you say you're off to fight Hooktail. But you're joking, right? I mean, you're not exactly a powerhouse. She'll eat you up! I know, Koopy Koo, but I want to be tougher for you. No, Koops, you don't. I mean, going off to some dangerous place, it's... It's stupid. So what if you're timid and sort of a crybaby? I don't care about all that. I just want you to be you, so don't go. Sorry, I made up my mind. I'll be fine. After all, I'm traveling with Mario in. Fuck! Ignore me! Stop it, Koopa! Oh, Koops, I think your girlfriend is she a little mad. I'm sorry, Koopy Koo. I swear to you, I will come back to you a stronger Koopa. Well, Mario, that's that, I guess. No turning back. Hooktail's castle awaits. Alright. And immediately sh fuck off. <laughs> Literally, I go to open the menu, and the game says, "Actually, you're reading an email." <laughs> that was funny. I don't want the flowers to claim my flush cloud. I'd rather not. <laughs> Can't lose any coins if you sit still. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if you 
lose coins that way in this game. You could, but I. Uh, you did in the first game. Ran off like. Fuck off. I don't want. Oh to god. Fight you. Oh god. Actually, maybe I do. Well, I, they only drop one item at a time, and I don't know if they're gonna drop all that. So. I don't. I don't. I don't yeah, I but don't that is know. a new item that I don't recognize. So hopefully that's the thing that gets dropped. We'll see. I, I don't know. So it's a little funny. When it it could go either way. It's either going to be the first one dropped or the most recent one dropped. And it was neither. Or something else. Okay. Something else entirely. Coops. Nice thing about Coops is his stylish moves are a lot easier to do compared to Goombella's. Has a chance of slowly restoring Mario's HP each turn during battles. Cool. Well, it has a chance. It won't always do it, admittedly. Yeah, but... The way these things work, it's going to be fairly often. It shouldn't be, but Well, it that's the be. case, then the Happy Heart hoed me, because it rarely did stuff for me. <laughs> you got the BP. There. Pokemon's sun. We evolved our Sunkern. We evolved our Clefairy. Pokemon Moon. Oh. Whoa. Well, that's a little. I already know where this is going. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not even gonna read it. Nope. Okay. Two switches, we just got a Koopa party member. Yeah. You hit, it had medieval speech written on there. It was really goofy. <laughs> oh well. I know I'm going to need to tattle something. It sure does look like a, a dragon castle. What do you mean there's nothing back here? You know, surprisingly enough, I don't think there is anything there. Which is lame, because I totally would have put something there if I was a game dev, but that's just me. Lame. <laughs> Steamed chicken? Probably. Me more? Tail castle. castle. Oh, I'm glad I came up here then. <laughs> Although there is something on the bottom, though. So, Hooktail Castle, huh? Well, it sure is ominous, that's for sure. But yes, there is something on the bottom, which I actually recommend you get this. Down, down, here. down, down to the bottom of the sea. Outstanding move, Gumbella. Anyways. Also, uh, mi amor, I'm gonna make your life easier. <laughs> Next time you switch a party member, press L. Oh my god. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get this show on the road! Well, now we have to go back and back up. So, yeah. Oh, it's an HP plus badge. Would you rather have it or not? Steam well, that's nice. I mean, did you what did you season them with? Yeah, what did you season them with? Because that, that makes a, a big difference. Yeah. You gotta prepare it the right way, you know? There's a right way to preferring uh, to preparing the right chicken. You cannot reach it up there. I tried several times. <laughs> to get there and have not prevailed at all. So I don't think it's designed that way. 
Mm, it looks like it should be. It looks like it. You're right, but I just haven't been able to. Bombs! <laughs> they were plain, sir? No, thank you. It might be the Latina in me, but I prefer my chicken seasoned. Because if I hit it, it's just going to register as a regular Koopa Troopa. My mic? Hello? Um... Hello? You are here. I can hear you. Thank you for calling. You are live on the air. Oh. Oh, my pick? The PFP fucking... <laughs> <sighs> it, it's literally just my Discord PFP. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just super in the Aspen Hotel lately. That's literally all it is. <laughs> uh, th that's literally oh, it, all it is. <laughs> I thought you said. I thought it was a typo. I thought you said my mic. <laughs> but yeah, no. I literally. I, I. This is just my Discord PFP. That's all it is, and I got it because I'm in. I'm in the Aspen Hotel lately, so I just have that. <laughs> I love Lucifer. He's so baby girl. <laughs> see. Okay. And and yes, I did not misspoke. I did say Lucifer. Yes, that is who is in it. <laughs> We are not responsible for your future actions. Hmm. Yeah. Bingo! Oh. Yeah. No. A stylish move state like could be anywhere, either before or after, or hell, even during an attack. So, like, don't stress too much if you can't find it. Like I said, that's why that training grounds toad exists. Yeah. <laughs> Don't blame me. I haven't even watched the show. <laughs> Sir, do you mind? I'm just trying to get this badge! <laughs> no, he does mind. He minds greatly. What just happened? Excellent question. So what was that about? The healing? N no, it's not on it. <laughs> okay, well it worked well for you, fucking. I don't know if I just put it on too late so that it, it didn't do shit for me anymore, but... Uh... I mean, it's only one HP at a time. Yeah. And no, it's not on either of the- it's absolutely not on Disney Plus. Well then again, I guess I have Deadpool on Disney Plus, so rating doesn't matter, but... No, it's not on either of those. Also, bear in mind that Cloud is in Europe, so... Oh. What's on what might be different, because regions. Oh, um, and I mean, it is American made and indie, so I, I don't know. You should be able to access it, because I know there's foreign languages, like translations and shit for it set up, so. Yeah, no, it's on Amazon. This is the way out. I don't know why I went this way. Cloud, cloud, please. <laughs> for the love of Christ. Avoided him expertly. Expert dodge. I don't trust this. Fuck you, game. Oh, oh no! Oh, no. <laughs> Actually, yeah, and you need him for this scene. <laughs> These bones, they remind me of my father. 
There's no doubt about it, it's my father! Dead! This is... oh, th that's fucked up. Um, wait, what's this? Maybe Lucifer can find him, maybe he ended up in hell. <laughs> my father's clutching some kind of letter, or at least his... Uh, bones are. Oh, that's so, awesome. what should I do? Should I... yeah, I would. <laughs> uh, okay, I can do this. I I'll read it. <laughs> Ahem. I came to this castle to destroy Hooktail. But I am stuck and can go no further. So in this letter, I shall note Hooktail's weaknesses with those who follow. The dwarf Hooktail cannot tolerate creatures, croaking creatures that begin with F and end with Rog. Are you kidding me? Yeah, Cloud. <laughs> the bull flu. Yes, they have that. <laughs> God fucking damn it. We need a mill here. We we need him. We need him. I heard that something will lead to Hooktail's weakness is hidden somewhere in this castle. One is to have any hope of defeating Hooktail. One must first find whatever that thing is. One last thing. If faced with ultimate doom, the fiend will surely use any twig to save herself. Alas, I don't have the strength to continue running. Already mist spells my eye. My last words go to my son, Col Colorado. I love you, and I'm proud of who you've become. Huh? My son, Colorado, not Coops! Oops, uh, yeah, I guess this isn't my father after all. Oh fuck, I got something but... to share with Colorado afterwards! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, apparently. But if this <laughs> oh, isn't shit. my father, I wonder if that player bones over there is my dad. Oh god, this is red. Red. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you clearly don't value your lives much if you come to this castle to disturb us. You will go no farther from this moment on. You'll be nothing but bones! Sir, I've chilled out in hell. Nothing scares me. Ah! <laughs> uh, what are they doing? It's no use. They're all over me. Man, what do we do? Uh. Uh, fight it! Fight it! Oh, shit. <laughs> Try again? Try again. Oh. Fuck's sake. Did you learn nothing? Then you deserve what comes next. You'll be nothing but bones! No, it was in Paper Mario 64 Club. Colorado. Hey, Mia Maud, what else can you do besides run and jump? Hammer. <laughs> you think whoever's controlling all those guys is around here somewhere? Listen, Why Goombella, the fuck are I you don't... back here? <laughs> you are so annoying. I swear to God. STOP DISTURBING MY SLUMBER! There we go. Alright! Sweet! Holy shit, that's a lot of guys! <laughs> Alright, Goombella, you know what to do! <laughs> Attack two, defense is one. These creeps throw bones to attack. Oh, and they build reinforcements too. Attacks that construct multiple dough bones at once are most effective. Well, it's time to put that power. I love that the entire audience is full of dull bones. Yeah. <laughs> defense is one. They don't get knocked down like Koopa Troops. No. Sadly, no. Itch? Ah, uh, crap. Biscuits. Oh, uh, oh, SOS! This is getting dangerous! <laughs> Lucky! SOS! 
You might want to use sweet tree. <laughs> sure. At least I would suggest this. <laughs> before, before anyone one croaks. The red bones. Oh, too red, I think. No fashion sense, you, you Isn't know. Isn't it the same color scheme as you? <laughs> Don't watch Husband Hotel. HP 5, attack 3, and defense 1. Unlike your average dull bones, even if you pound it to zero, it, it crumbles. It totally might revive, like a zombie! Gross. My advice is to get rid of all the dull bones and then attack the red bones. Oh, and one more thing. Once its friend starts to fall, it may create some more. Outstanding. We're about to die. <laughs> We're fine. <laughs> I'm in danger! So if I do hit the, uh, poison, poison mushrooms, poison. what, does that just lower one randomly? It stuns you. No, it stuns you. It stuns you for a while, and then you're stuck while those things fall, so be, be careful. Look at that. Full recovery, practically. Pretty much. Cloud, I didn't even say anything! I am busy commentating if you didn't notice. And yes, it's on Amazon, and I think you have to. Ha it's like Prime, Amazon Video Prime. So yes, I think you have to pay. Like if you have a Pri if you have a Prime account, then yeah, you can watch it easily. Yeah. I mean, if you like musicals, I recommend it. Water and water and water, 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 He did get water. Rehydration station, wild. Yes. God damn, 50 now. Yes. Off we go. Also, I don't know if you noticed this, but the battle th battle theme has changed. I did notice. And I love that it's different now. It's more serious and it's different tone and different fucking like key and everything. And I love that shit. I love it. I love that there's differentiation with battle themes depending on the area that you're in. I appreciate that. I eat that shit for breakfast. Please and thank <laughs> you. Right? Oh my god, especially the one in chapter 3 and 4. Oh my god, it's so good. Shine, Sprite. I guess we're not done with our uh, adventures at Isle Delfino. <laughs> no, we are not. Koops is very useful, as you can see. Yes. All right, Vinny, you heard the man. I can make that. Yes, you can. Hit the wall, other side. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah. Is that a threat or a promise, Cloud? Knowing him, it's both. In all honesty. Going up? Goodbye! <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> he met with an unfortunate accident. <laughs> yeah, basically. I see. Castle key. We need that. Also, I just want you to know that on at least two of those uh, shell shots there, uh, I press down on the the right stick because that's normally C down. In virtual oh, wow. console. Nah, 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 the same. Saint 64, I know. <laughs> I know. Doesn't mean I'm not gonna do Technically, dumb shit you could like also that. press X, that's also C down. <laughs> Depending on the version you're playing, yeah. That seems important. Well, do you know a way to get it? Nope. Then let's bounce! Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's the simple things that make me laugh. <laughs> Excuse what? you, what? I'm trying to investigate a thing. <laughs> Party members can use items! I don't think I have any FP restoration items. Oh, wow, do you not? I think I have the thing that you told me, hey, save that for later, and that's it. Oh, shit. Uh, this is... I didn't want a backseat game too much. You could get the turtle leaf, but it only restores three. Yeah, but that's the thing you said, save that for later. I mean, we could always get more, it's not a big deal. I guess. Also, you could have stored that in the store. It has that same function. Yeah, I just forgot to do it while we were there. <laughs> well, here's hoping. Yeah! Bingo! Full house! We get full star power. Hey, do you go? Oh, right, FP. Well, you just got full star power. All right. Beautiful. That's what I love to see. You love to see it. I don't know why it keeps dropping my inputs, though. That's really annoying. I don't know either. That did happen to me one time when I was playing through the game. It's very interesting. Because does the hammer not hurt that? Oh, he's got the... Boost. That's right. Yeah. That's Use the courage shell.
Well, that guy's dead. Cool. <laughs> well, I hope we own the guy. We almost got our unit of star power back because we're back to zero FP. Oh, thank Christ! <laughs> thank Christ! Yes. That's a sound effects thing. Uh, yeah, I would recommend getting it when you get the chance. You on a timer? Yep. Leave me be, leave me be, Oosh! you bitch! Is there a good place to level grind? Not that I know of. Okay. Courage shell! Useful. Speaking of the courage shell. But now I have to reset up this because, you know, that guy's an asshole. <laughs> You cannot go that way. There is only hole. H. S H A D. Ah, crap baskets. <laughs> oh dang! <laughs> I miss this voice. Hey, guest, it's been a long time since anyone came here. A real long time. Huh? You heard me? Wow! Wait a sec. If you could hear my voice, you must be some legendary hero or something. Or not. To be honest, I'm sure anyone with ears can hear me. But it sure is fun zinging people with that whole legendary hero bit. Yeah, were you hey, lying to us? Seriously, folks, I was wondering if you could let me out of this chest. I've been locked in here so long, it's starting to cramp up like you wouldn't believe. All you have to do is find a key and let me out. Easy. Huh? What do you mean? I don't know about that. You think you'll be cursed if you open up the box? Ridiculous. Who would do that, really? Wait, in a box of cursed folks? A real slime ball, that's who. But I'm not a real slime, though, and I would do no such thing. But that should be obvious. Mm, I don't well, know. Could you help me out? Maybe I'll help you out. You know, a little I scratch your back, you scratch mine, except in reverse order. Uh, of course, you don't have to if you don't really want to. Finding a key like this is hard. Something tells me it's going to be the next room over. Probably. Oh. <sighs> Just go get it. This would be. It's not. I see spike holes. I don't <laughs> trust it. Fine. Mm. Uh, Mario, look at that. Oh, you're fucking me right now. I don't like the look of this. Come on, run! I only let you do it just so you know where you came from. <laughs> ah! Goodbye, Coops! <laughs> Teleport! Chill here. <laughs> yep. <sighs> Gotta do my stretches, you know. Who's <laughs> having a panic attack while <laughs> stretching? <laughs> Mario! Mario! <laughs> 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 <sighs> All right. I guess we should go through this door, huh? Mario! All right. <laughs> Hey, guy, I got your key. <laughs> hey there, boy, am I so glad you found that key? Unbelievable! <laughs> no danger here whatsoever. <laughs> this is mine. <laughs> Fool. Like, 
like fucking passed out as soon as he goes through the door. I mean, do you see how beat up he looks? <laughs> Why, well, only the most idiotic pudding brain dolt will fall for a scheme like that. The castle's traps prevent anyone who's entered the place from ever leaving it. No matter which path you take, you're forced to waste away to a slow, painful end. But wait, there's more to this great deal. I'll throw in a free curse, no charge. Oogly well, googly boo. More. But wait, there's more. <laughs> <laughs> now you're cursed, doofus, and it serves you right. This curse is more cursedly curseworthy than any curse that's ever cursed you. For this wow. curse makes you like a piece of paper when you press and hold ZR. <laughs> what a curse. Who likes curses? No one. Now I shall show you just how fretful a curse it is. Press and hold ZR now. You are paper. <laughs> <laughs> just look at yourself, how embarrassing for you. You'll be all papery thin while you press ZR. Just try and jump or move and you'll probably just wobble there. Do you understand what this curse means? Yeah, I got it. I will say, that's gonna be annoying if, like, wind strikes you. <laughs> well, here's the thing. If the wind blows... Um... If the wind is blowing this way... Then I go this way, and I'm fine. If I go the other way, then I would get blown. Fair. Yeah, now we know what to do. Now give it a little squeeze. Squeeze through. Froggy. Froggy! <clears throat> get me, let, get me, get me, thank you. Oh good, it's got no requirements. Yeah, nah. But now you sound froggy! Outstanding. <laughs> Cloud! What the fuck just happened? You received a gift from a friend. Cloud! <laughs> nice. Thank you, Cloud! <laughs> I got the notification, I was like, oh, cool, something went on sale, let's see what it is. I look down, and it's like, oh no, actually, you got a thing. Uh, what is it? What did you do? Was it even on sale? Also, I have no idea when I'm going to play that. <laughs> Just to let you know. Yay. Eventually. Eventually. I still can't get this. I don't know what I'm doing. Don't worry about that for now. Where am I going? That's a great question. <laughs> That's where we came from. I don't get enough distance. It means there's no, some you, other way to get that. No, you won't ever too. You, you, there's another way to get that. Alright, so then I do have to continue this way somehow. I guess I have this now, so I can do something. Okay, I don't remember uh, needing to go back here. Though, that's weird. Alright, it looked like a dead do end. Do we have a key? No, the oh, key's okay. there. It was there. Okay. There we go. I don't know why I forgot about that. <laughs> Bye, Coops. <laughs> Let me in. Let me in! Or, I guess, out. Even that has a froggy sound. <laughs> no, that's just the sound effects of the game. That wasn't even the badge. Oh.
Why? <laughs> I wanted to see if I could pause buffer uh, a jump. I can. Kind of. Kind of. And now I think this is... Something else! Okay, second floor. Yes, take it. Yeah. The sleep today will be great. I'm sure. Because you said the, uh... The chicken made you sleepy. How does that work? I did the thing again, by the way. Where I pressed down on the control stick. Or the right stick. Oh. You'll get the hang of it. Anything weird you see in the background? It's so fucking bright out here! What the hell? <laughs> My well, eyes! With how dingy this castle is, are you surprised? <laughs> No, but it's just like complete bright white light out. I mean, that's just aesthetic. The aesthetic almost fucking blinded me. Let's see if we could get one more level up. Oh, we absolutely are. Before the boss. Bitch! You tried. Did you realize there's also- there, you could still go get it, right? Yeah, I just don't feel like going all the way down for it. Miyamoto, trust me, you want this. I- I guess... You want it, trust me. Either way, I need to beat these guys to a bloody pulp before I can. Oh. Slowly but surely. Annoying you to no end, is it? the recommendations on what to watch while you go to sleep. Uh, it depends on what you're looking to watch. Like, are you trying to watch, like, an episode of a TV show? Are you trying to watch someone, a uh, video on YouTube? Are you trying to continue watching the stream? Or what do you have in mind? Alright. More BP! You're supposed to jump off the other way. <laughs> How was I supposed to know that? <laughs> I don't know, I thought it was obvious. Life shroom! I do not have anything ready for afterwards, so... Excuse 
Oh my, who's this handsome piece of cheese? I can't believe there are other thieves here besides me. How very strange. Hey, who are you? Me? Why, I'm Miss Malice, the globe-trotting thief. Heard of me, sweetie? Never. I heard there were rare and valuable badges here in this castle. That's why I'm here. But the real question is, why are people like you roaming in such a rundown place? Uh, well, you see, we're here to build a hooktail and get the, uh, the crystal star. So don't think we'll let you get the crystal star first, no matter how cute you are. Crystal star, you say? <laughs> you know, a thing like that was hidden in this castle. Damn it, Coops! Sounds intriguing. Perhaps I just heard something you didn't want me hearing? <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> oh, but that's okay. I mean, you were looking for the crystal star first. And I already found the badge I was after, so I'll let you have your crystal star. Something tells me we're gonna have to fight her for a crystal star at some point. Um, hey, what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> it means I must say bye bye for now, Mr. Cutie. I know, it's sad we just met, <laughs> and already it is time to say farewell. Thank you for the bottle. Oh my, you're so bold. Is that legal? Mario, <laughs> how old are you? Oh, I almost oh, forgot. I have a little secret to share with you. Oh no. <laughs> Mario's gonna get fucking cancelled. <laughs> Somewhere in this castle is a badge uh, that'll help you best hook tailor, so I've heard. I already have it. <laughs> I don't know what kind of badge it is. Maybe you found it already, maybe not. I already did. If you're going to fight hook tail, I'd recommend fighting that badge first. I'll take care, handsome mustache man. Let's get together again real soon. I wonder what her story is. I bet it's an interesting one, full of romance. I have my doubts, Coops. <laughs> Mushroom. Key. Oh, that's helpful. Honey syrup. Shine sprite. Depth perception. Lots of loot. <laughs> it's okay. All right, let's go. Please leave me be. No. Please leave me be. <laughs> Expertly dodged, I must admit. You have to fight them eventually. Somebody left immediately. <laughs> yeah, they do that if you don't do damage. <laughs> the bigger the group of enemies, the better that gets. I s All right, let's do a normal bounce on this guy to get rid of his item. And then I'm just a regular shell toss. Should be fine on them. Yep. Okay. Cool. Yeah, Koops' uh, stylish moves are very easy to do, by the way. Like, press A immediately after the attack. That's all it is. Hmm. I haven't even tried. <laughs> <laughs> just reminding you. Also, a thought has occurred to me. I probably need to ride that up. So... I, I thought that's what we were going to do. <laughs> yeah, I didn't set him up, though, because I didn't think about it until after the battle. Oh, at least, you, at least you realized. That is a star piece. This was probably a lot easier on the GameCube where the controllers had notches. It's fine. I can plane here. Yes. But there is a pretty glittery star piece that's shiny and cute, and I want it. Would you give me a star piece? <laughs> 
It's shit like this is probably why they added Mario, like, leaning over the edge. <laughs> because they know- I don't know if he does that. I think he only does that for, like, rope or, or, like, near when, like, bodies of water, though. He did it just now. Oh, did he? When I went too far up. Maybe he does. Hmm. Anyway, let's paper plane this! Or could there be something back there? Let's... Nope, it's a dead end. You <laughs> fucking goops. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> Good. I believe I could fly. <laughs> Ten? Grand Why are we staircase. going up in price? It always does that. <laughs> Hmm. Okay. Something tells me I don't want that. Actually... What do you mean? Like, I don't want to go down there. Oh, you could go down there if you want, but I, don't, I would get the key first. <laughs> Well, because here's the thing. I don't know what's down there, and I don't know what's up here, but there's a, a, a heel here. So I'm like, this is probably more important. If you want, but I think you just found a way to get your badge. If it is what I think it is. It should be. Problem then becomes, how the frick do I get back up? Because if I have to go all the way around to get back up, that's really fucking annoying. Because hmm. I can't do the coops thing because it immediately hits this. And if I go this way, it immediately hits the box. It's up to you if you want to get it or not. Maybe on the way out. Because I don't want to have to okay. go all the way back around. Yeah, I don't remember if there's a switch below there that does that for you or not. I don't think, think it does. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember there being one, so, I mean, it's up to you. <sighs> Alright. Alright! Bridge! <laughs> We're getting somewhere. Mm. Damn it, I fucked it up. Come on, it's one fight, you can handle I it. I weaved when I should have bobbed. lost my entire audience. Oh my god. What the fuck game? So that's what that does. I knew I didn't want to get those, but shit. Like I said, that almost happened to me during a very important fight, so that almost fucked me over. <laughs> so this is the trade-off for me consistently getting the heals from that 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 um RNG healing badge. By the way, I get shit like that. Outstanding. Hey, the audience is back. Slowly coming back.
All right. Cool. Wonderful. Okay. Cool. Did I say you could get up? Did I stutter? Bitch. Game says fuck you. Mm-hmm. That's how this normally goes. <laughs> it's okay. It's why I'm here, and it's why you'll survive. So why was that one ten if this one is six? Forgot about that. Holy shit. <laughs> God damn it, game. <laughs> damn, we got debated. That's crazy. I mean, I needed it, so whatever. But like, God damn it. <laughs> Listen, at least like we have an excuse because of that, those three poison mushrooms. Who dares approach me? Dragon. It is indeed dragon. Roar. Hmm. I didn't expect more to come to steal the treasure I protect. Dragon. That was foolish, I fear. Do you really think you can beat me? Dragon. Donkey. <laughs> but you're so small. And don't appear tasty. I suppose you might make a good snack. Oh, you're a girl dragon. Of course you are. <laughs> After gnawing on the bottoms of your feet, I'll saute you to crispy goodness and gobble you down. First. Are we sure this dragon isn't oh. Jordan? <laughs> I know. Oh my god. Snack time, little appetizers. Which one of you morsels should I taste first? I should have come in here with Goombella. Well, can't go back now. <laughs> I don't know why I put her in front for that. <laughs> I, I don't know either. Sound. It sounds like a frog. How did you know? <laughs> I got really bad <sighs> food poisoning once when I ate a frog. I hate them! Outstanding. Uh, fight it, Hooky. Just hearing the sounds of them makes me feel woozy. Fire! Ow. That sure is fire. That's Hooktail. Max HP 20, attack 5, defense 1. She'll stomp and munch on you, and she has a more dragonous attack. Stinky, fiery breath. She's tricky, especially when she's losing, and she'll try to fool you into being merciful. Oh yeah, and one more thing. She hates things that start with F and end with ROG. Supposedly, there's something related to that somewhere in the castle. Did we find it? Yes. Shockingly. Yes, yes. Uh, must not gag. So very woozy. What did Hooktail say? That she, uh, she's not that, allowed that, to say. I was gonna say that's a great question. <laughs> so I'm trying to find it. Yeah, let's put Mario up front. I can jump. Can I hammer? I think I can hammer. If I can hammer, power smash. Oh! Game says fuck you! Bonus damage.
you were saying. The feet count. Oh. Oh, okay. I mean... Listen, if Dan Schneider can get away with it, so can we. <laughs> That's not where I was gonna go, but okay! <laughs> oh my god! Dan, welcome back! You didn't hear anything! You didn't hear that! You didn't hear that! <laughs> god damn it. I don't know what you thought you hear, Kim, but it, uh... Was not anything too, too crazy. Hopefully. Wait! Hold up a moment! I give up! Please, I won't be so bad anymore, I promise! In fact, I'm sorry for everything! Uh, yeah. Where's my ukulele? To prove it, I'll give you 10,000 coins! What do you say? Can you forgive me? Me... Mi amor? Don't it's let your intrusive 10, thoughts 10,000 coins! I have to be by your side. I always have to babysit you because you'll make yourself <laughs> nuked otherwise. It's 10,000 coins, though! 10,000 coins. <laughs> You're just inside Hooktail's gut. Dang, these 10,000 coins are looking real weird. Fine, I'll say no. <laughs> exactly! 10,000 coins is 10,000 coins! That's a lot of coins! What? You must be joking. You don't need any coins? Uh, how about the lovely rare extra special badge I have? I'll give you that. What is it? It's a one of a kind and it's yours for a limited time only. Will what is it? it? Yeah, exactly. His hat says M for money. <laughs> but the badge... Uh, that, that has actual genuine utility. But you don't even know what it is. Fine. Uh, really? Well, I suppose I could apologize by letting you smell the bottoms of my feet. Seriously. I hate whoever I hate whoever <laughs> clips this. <laughs> so, care to take? <laughs> it's a damn good thing I'm the one playing and not Jordan. I can't fucking keep it in. You aren't a very trusting fella, are ya? It's important to be able to trust someone, you know? Yeah. Thank you, Kim. <laughs> I hate you all. I guess I better. Excuse foul. you? That is foul. Bull. No shit. <laughs> uh, now my strength has returned to me. That's it. Enough of this. Let's finish her off once and for all, Mario. Oh, we took the fight into the fucking stands. <laughs> we broke the fourth wall. Why do I always have to feel so faint every time I hear a, a frog? Ow. Son of a bitch. Ribbit. Croak. The only one croaking is you, bitch! What? I... <laughs> oh, why? There's still so much I wanted to do with my life! So many meals! Yeah? <laughs> Nice. So, I imagine it's easier to get um, money in this game because I already have 300 and we're only at chapter yes, one. Yes, it is very easy to get money in this game. Okay. Yes! We did it, Mario! 
All we have to do now is search for the crystal star. We can't seem to locate. Where the hell is it? Uh. What the hell? Yeah, I'm out. I'm finally out. Whoa, it it can be. Ah, ha, ha, ha. I am here. <laughs> D Dad? Well, if it isn't Coops. Hello, son. You've gotten so big since I saw you last. How long were you in there? Well, yeah, I guess I have, but who cares, Dad? Yeah, how long has Coop's dad been missing? <laughs> I mean, golly, what happened to you? Uh, where have you been all this time? Well, I came here a while back to deal with Hooktail, and all was well and good. But bef just before my finishing blow, she used the smell of her feet to stun me, and then gobbled Sir? me down Is this Jordan? <laughs> <laughs> I've been hiding in my shell for the ten years since then? Ten years? Inside Hooktail's belly. And boy, was it's it nasty. dirty damn, bro. Yeah, honestly. <laughs> I'm so glad to finally get out. <laughs> honestly, Dad, everyone's been so worried about you this whole time. Oh, sorry, son, but I'm okay. That's good, right? We're together now, right? Yeah, What's he that has must to. Stink? Are we sure his dad doesn't stink more than the dragon? <laughs> Speaking of which. What are all of you doing here anyway? Oh, might stink even worse. Come on, Dad. We came here to defeat Hooktail. And Mr. Mario here is looking for a gem called the Crystal Stir. Crystal Stir. Crystal Star. <laughs> this wouldn't be what you're talking about, would it? <laughs> I'm dirty, Dad. <laughs> What's that? I found it down there in Hooktail's belly. Nice, huh? I was going to keep it as a souvenir. But if this is the thing you've been looking for, you can have it. Come now, I won't take no for an answer. You're Coops' friend, right? Please, take it. You got a crystal star! Your star power has increased to two. Mario also learned the special move, Earth Tremor. Each so time you get useful, a crystal star... useful, 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 useful. You'll learn a new special move. <laughs> Bro literally lived inside of a dragon for 10 years. It'll How be weird when he gets survive? home, his wife has remarried. Honestly, I don't doubt the possibility. Using the magical map they received from Princess Peach, Mario and his friends claimed their first crystal star. With the deadly dragon Hooktail defeated, the citizens of Petalburg would rest easy once again. Koops even reunited with his long-lost father, whom he thought was dead. I mean, that is the logical conclusion to come to. And yet, despite victory in the castle... Princess Peach's whereabouts were still unknown. Where could she be? Yes, it seems Mario's adventure has only just begun. Ew. Oops, dad will now not shower and just hangs out with his son's girlfriend, also best crystal star get. You know... Uh, considering he's a party member, yeah, no, I, I could see that being the case with Goops' dad. No wonder Coop's left. Um, actually, oh great exalted Grotus, we brought the Princess Peach you ordered, sir. Well, 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 my pet. Isn't it about time you told us where the map is? Oh god. What the is The main he? antagonist is a redditor. Princess Peach, she will speak when spoken to. <laughs> I'm telling you, I don't know. There's no point in trying to hide it, silly girl. We know you had it. We know this. We know this, Trust lady. Me, very much in your interest to be absolutely honest with us. We Xnauts are not all rainbows and lollipops, I assure you. We're quite nasty. Didn't we say this was gonna be Elon Musk? You know what? Uh, this works. Grounded, <laughs> sir. I have news. <laughs> we pulled it once. You know that crystal star we thought maybe a hooktail had? Well, someone nabbed it. What? What did you say? Someone else is after the crystal stars. 
and they defeated that hooktail creature you say? Speak, soldier. <laughs> yes, sir. Sorry, sir. There's more. Too. Damn, we started See, a lot of report, bits since we started this stream. It was a mustache dude with a red hat and blue overalls who pulled the job. Yo. Excuse me, Mo, yo. Bitch, you couldn't keep your mouth shut. <laughs> <laughs> I see. So you know of this Mario, do you? This fool matters not at all. I'll know all about him before long, that I promise. I grow bored of talking. Take Princess Peach back to the holding room. Yes, sir. And men, take good care of Princess Peach. Understand, she is not to be harmed. You got it, sir. Oh my god, he really is a Redditor. <laughs> well, Lord Crump, if this Mario character has the map, then it's highly likely he'll show up while we're hunting for a Christmas star, Boggly Woods. He must return there immediately and hasten the search. It must not fail. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Roger, Garrett, is that with that? Exactly. Oh, I'm gone. They're called x knots What do you think that means nowadays? What do you think that means nowadays? I wonder if sending Lord Crump there alone is wise. He's a bit... out there. Hmm... x not I summon you! You rank, dude? I mean, sir, uh, you rank Sir Discord, dude, 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 Okay, I'm gonna shut up now. Chill up. Go get the three shadows over here. The three sh shadows, sir, but they... I don't care how you plan to end that sentence, fool. Go get them. No. Gotcha. Um, actually... The Honorable Grotus has need of us, then we arrive without delay. <laughs> Pray tell, what did the princess tell you where the map is? It seems the poor fool named Mario now has a possession of the map. This wouldn't have happened if you had kidnapped Princess Peach when you were supposed to. It wasn't my fault. Truly, the town square has too many prying eyes. Too many. Besides, she was soon joined by some old fool of an attendant. Such a fussy fungus. Worry not, all we need to do is find this Mario and... Happy yet. Indeed, that is your duty. Must I remind you, that map is vital to the x not plan. I will have my men prepare all available information on this Mario. For now, hear me build him. You three shadows must take care of this troublemaker. <laughs> Fear not, sire. I, Beldum, shall turn with what you seek. Let's go, my lovelies. Marilyn, Vivian, come. We have a job to do. Go! <laughs> All right, cool. Oh dear, here we go again. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! Here we go again. I can't believe I'm kidnapped again. Everyone must be worried sick again. Hold on a moment. Where in the world am I anyway? It's so unfamiliar. I mean, yeah, it's not Bowser's castle for once. Yeah. I wish I, I could at least let Mario know that I've been caught. Awesome. Opening. Of course not. Just put on sword. Uh, you're about 20 years too soon for that. doors open by themselves. It's called technology. Yes. Although I don't know why it was on a delay. Weird. It doesn't look like anyone's around. But 
they keep making doors open? How odd. <laughs> Can you imagine her in like a modern day grocery store with the sliding doors? <laughs> well, in that scenario, she would know what's going on. Not be, you know, kidnapped against her will. I suppose. Is that the hell fucking 2000? Hello, right. princess Peach. What? Said that? Are you? How amusing. I am right here before your eyes. I am this laboratory's main computer. I am the Tech XX. Many call me Tech. You may. Sir Grotus created me to be a perfect computer. One that is flawless in its reason. Grotus? Wait, he's that awful dome-headed thing who interrogated me, right? Sir Grotus is not awful. He is a very great streamer. He is marvelous. <laughs> well, I don't think so. He was sexually harassing me, but I doubt I'll change your mind. So I'm wondering, why did you leave me in here? <laughs> is that a computer from Wally? -E? I was thinking a space odyssey. An unusual program deviation occurred when I observed you just after. You were brought here. Would Peach play Roblox or would she play Minecraft? That's the big question. <laughs> Roblox. <laughs> My higher brain circuitry malfunctioned and nearly overheated at your image. Also, an unidentified impulse sped through my processors. These events are new to me. Oh my god, he's letting the intrusive thoughts win. <laughs> <laughs> Neuron activation. There is more to this phenomenon as well. I ran diagnostic programs. <laughs> and their solution was, I want to know more about you. I want to observe you. Such a compulsion has no precedence. Cause unknown. I, the perfect computer, must diagnose this unusual situation. I will not fail. That is why I led you here. I want to know what love is. <laughs> Wait, did you just say you want to observe me to know more about me? <gasps> it be that you... No, impossible. It can't be. You're a computer. What has happened to me? I want... If you know my malfunction, you must tell me of it. <clears throat> Couldn't really, because... You're weird. Please tell me, please. I am the world's best computer. I am perfect. There should be not anything that I do not understand. Please. Well, you know, maybe... Is it possible that you're in love? Me? Love? What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. It was right don't there. Don't hurt me. Right no there, more. I was waiting for it. <laughs> I cannot compute this. Wait, you don't know what love is? Love? Why explain? Love tells you when you want to be with a person forever. It makes you feel happy just to see that person happy. Smiling, having fun. When you love someone, you will do anything to help when that person is in trouble. Happiness? Fun. I have definitions for these words, but... My programming is insufficient. There should be nothing I cannot comprehend. I am a perfect computer. Brand love? Love's not something you comprehend, Tech. You just feel it. Princess Peach, will you teach me to feel this thing you call love? I want to make an awful joke, but I'm not going to. I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. <laughs> Elaborate. <laughs> what? You're a computer? Why would you care about love? <laughs> there must be nothing that I cannot comprehend. Please explain. <laughs> 
Don't worry, you don't get in trouble, Kim. <laughs> it's too Listen. fresh of an incident. Listen. <laughs> If we can go into Nikhil's kinks live on stream, you can make a dumb joke. <laughs> I was gonna say, is this a Pokemane's editor, bro? <laughs> <laughs> uh, that is why you must help me understand this thing called love. Please. If you have any oh, wishes that, that I can grant you in exchange, I will grant them. But of course, I am unable to grant such a wish as letting you escape. I cannot believe this! You jerks kidnapped me before I can even begin to enjoy my vacation! And now you call me in here and ask me to teach you the meaning of love? I should spit on your screen! You'll grant my wishes? <laughs> Why should I believe you? I understand you are angry. That emotion, I can comprehend. You need not teach me now. <laughs> Nikhil would like that. <laughs> Observation added to archives. But I must learn of this thing. I must. There is no alternative. I must be a perfect computer. That is why, if you would just consider teaching me, I will grant your wishes. Do you understand me, Princess Peach? Now tell me your wish. <laughs> Are you sure? Exactly. <laughs> oh god. Okay, well, here goes. Can I contact someone? The sooner the better. Yes, of course you may. Use my communicator to send wireless mail to anywhere you want. If you so wish, you can use it right now. It is no trouble. Use the keyboard in front of you. Enter the recipient address and message. You mean this keyboard? All right, let me give this a shot. Hey, it's ready, Tech. Could you send it? The message has been sent. For the time being, you may return Mario, to your room. Oh, Mario has I will call you in again. Yes, so he's able to get email. <laughs> <laughs> something like that. I will call you in again when I want to ask you something. Mario has something like, like a, 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 a PDA like a or DS something like that. Yeah, like a DS looking PDA. Uh, okay then, good night. Good night, Princess Peach. Totally not ominous. <laughs> oh yeah, Bowser! What is Bowser doing? <laughs> He's vibing. Doom, He's doom, just vibing. Doom, doom, doom. I love how it's similar architecture to the first game. Like yes. the blue flames and all. I don't know, it just makes me happy they did that. <laughs> Bowser, the mighty Koopa King, has arrived! Hold your applause, minions! But now that I'm here, Cammy, you crusty old hag, why'd you summon me? Uh, Great Lord Bowser, the, uh, crusty hag, Kami Koopa, will arrive momentarily. I'm really sorry for the inconvenience, but please wait at the rear of the room. Goddamn assholes. <laughs> Making me wait in my own fucking throne room. Oh, you room. can talk to everyone if you want, which oh I my recommend, because really? they are... Yeah. Lord Bowser, I've been training day and night to help you conquer the world. Should the time come, I shall be ready. Order me as you please, your surliness. Uh, super. In that case, I order you to do some sit-ups. Don't stop till you even have even your hammer has abs. Bowser can jump. Uh, sort of. So the other day, I saw Lord Bowser gazing longingly at a photo of Princess Peach. 
Ooh, you may want to put a cork in it, man. Ooh, let me tell you, the look on his face when he was mooning over that thing. Uh, ah, Lord Bowser. Well, I'm dying to hear the rest of your hilarious story, Mr. Comedian. Do share. He was also playing a piano and singing a song. Peaches, 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 peaches. <laughs> Greetings, your huffiness. The hag, Kami Koopa, will be arriving at any moment. Lord Bowser, please, if it's not too much trouble, head to the rear of the hall. Hail Lord Bowser. Where the fuck were you, bitch? Lord Bowser. She walks so slow. I've now just returned. I'm terribly sorry to keep you waiting, my lord. I bet you are, Kami Koopa. Now out with it. Why have you called me here? Please, your grumpiness. Don't be so impatient with your poor servant. <clears throat> it's my pleasure to report that Mario, that scum, is wrong. Is off to a town called Rogueport. I mean, we've been in Rogueport for a while now, technically. Yeah, <laughs> we've been there. <laughs> Am I Mario's babysitter? I don't care what he's doing. Are you gonna call me every time that guy blows his nose or what? Sheesh. Yes, will you see, my lord? Apparently, Mario is hunting for an amazing treasure. T treasure? Yes, Mario has gone in search of star-shaped jewels known as the Crystal Stars. I'm researching just what they are, but there's no question of their high value. The Crystal Stars, you say? They sound like good world-conquering tools. I want them. Shockingly hmm. good intuition. Yes, very good. Continue researching this for me, you brainy hag you. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Leave it to me. By the way, Lord Bowser, do you like fried eggs? Yes. Do I? I love fried eggs. Love them. But what a weird question. Why do you ask? Well, during my Mario recon, I stopped in a lovely place called Petal Meadows. I was planning on taking everyone there for a picnic, having some eggs and toast. Random? Of course, I wouldn't think of sending out invites without asking you first, Lord Bowser. <laughs> Lunkhead! A picnic? Get serious, this is no time for fun. See, this is why my evil plans always derail, because you cards always goof off. Ah! Damn! Please <coughs> remember your blood pressure! What about pancakes, though, Kim? Mm, what was that? I don't want to hear about pancakes ever again. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what? Is this true? Lord Bowser, terrible news! Some bold fool abducted Princess Peach in Rogueport! I am so confused. Uh, what? Context. Tell me you're lying, Cammy. How? When? Where? Who'd do such a thing besides me? <laughs> I'm afraid we don't have that information quite yet. The investigation's ongoing. Kimberly, I swear to God. I am so confused. <laughs> One thing is most certainly confirmed, however. The princess has been kidnapped. Under no circumstances is anyone allowed to kidnap her without my say-so. I will not stand for this. I'm going to Rogueport now. I've got to kidnap her back. Yeah? I like it. she just walked 
for three steps and he got in the cart. Sir, that is your own castle. I don't think he cares. But your grunginess, wait up! <sighs> Listen, as long as the pancakes don't touch spicy takoyaki, we should be fine. <laughs> pancake day? I mean, I know how to make buttermilk pancakes! <laughs> Who coops my lad? Are you telling me that you're going with Mario? Um, that's right, Dad. I'm going to continue traveling with Mario. And then I'm, well, I'm going to come back a strong Koopa like you, Dad. Nicely said, young Koops. That's my boy. But always remember this. You are my son, Koops, and I am your father. Be right here waiting for you to prove yourself. Ahem. And may I just stand, if anything happens, you can always come home, group. Don't you ever forget that. This village will always be our home. Oh, thank you, everyone. Well, I'm off. Sorry to keep you waiting, Mario. You know, farewells. So, where are we going? Let's head back to Roadport. Remember, Mario? Hold the magical map aloft before the entrance to the Thousand Year Door. Then the stars will light the way that leads to the stones of yesterday. Listen. And it didn't stop there. I'm trying. Each stone of yesterday shall shine and point towards the next in line. That's what the books say. Which means, if we take the crystal star we found back to the Thousand Year Door. So, that means... The location of the next crystal star will appear on the magic map? Exactly! Come on, let's go! Alright. Vominos! Come on, Vominos! <laughs> Everybody, let's go! Come on, let's get to it! I know that we can do it! But we'll be doing it next time. Why does he have a wisp? I don't know. Because I thought it'd be not? funny. <laughs> Anyway, uh, that's it for today. And I'm just like, man, who? Who? Do we know an Amanda? <sighs> I know several. But I don't know what Amanda Kim knows. Amanda the Adventurer? I've never heard of this Amanda. I'm so confused. Me <laughs> too. So Don't worry, it's not just you. Anyway, that's gonna be it for today. Uh, I think we said next Tuesday for continuing this. Okay. Does that sound right? Oh, that fucking indie game. I know what you're talking about, Kim. Huh? Um, yeah, no, it's a it's a horror indie game. Okay. With backstory and stuff. <laughs> I forgot that existed. Next week? Yeah, no, we can do it next week. Okay. Alright. See you next time. See you. Thank you all for coming. Thank you. Except, you know, Kim, who disappeared for, like, half the thing. <laughs> well, she showed up eventually. That's what matters.